Hello, everybody. Hello. Welcome, welcome. How's it going? How's everyone doing? Welcome. Welcome on in. I have been scrabbling to get everything ready while the countdown was happening. I am incredibly, incredibly late to do literally everything at the moment. Um, I've, uh, I, I spent an hour looking for some postcards which I've mislaid. I still haven't found them. I don't know where they are. I can guarantee I am going to find them the second I end the stream. I can, I can just feel it. I can just feel it in, in my every sense of my being. I'm gonna find it after the stream ends. But alas, I couldn't find them for now. But that's okay, because I've got plenty of other things, which I am extremely excited to to share. Also, the, the camera really does not like that I don't have much to focus on at the moment. What if I do that? My hands are so big that I have tiny hands. I, I compare it to the, the monster can, I got, I got little hands. They just look big because there's nothing else here. <laughs> They only look big because there's nothing here. I got little hands. Should see them next to next to my brother's hands, next to Xander's hands. I I look like a, a literal child. It's so funny. <laughs> but welcome in everybody. Hello, hello. Hold on, let me let me like move this. Make a bit more space. Push everything to the side. I have got so much space on this desk of mine. It it looks like the space. There's not actually space. This is like a tiny amount of space. I just managed to make it look big by um, very carefully placing the camera. And <laughs> so it's uh my my desk isn't actually very big. My hands also aren't very big. Everything just looks big because I'm using camera trickery to make it seem that way. Like if I like lay my monster can here, like this is how big the space I have is. <laughs> my monster. But thank you for the hydrate. Hydrate to start. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. There it is. Ha ha ha! The live can opening. Thank you! I've got the Ultra Fiesta today. I probably should have shown the side as I said that before I opened it, but it's open now, so... I got my monster! And I'm gonna put it over here. You, oh, you can't even see it here. Hold on. <laughs> Hold on, I wanna... Uh... That'll do. You can tell it's monster. I've got a kind of sprite as well for when I want that. But uh, welcome in, everybody. Welcome, welcome. Oh my goodness, Addy, hi. Wait, let me go from the top of the list. Uh, Rika, congratulations on the first. Hello. Welcome on in. Welcome, Bob. I hope you have a good lunch, Lurk. <laughs> Hello, how's Kitty? You get to see my hands. These are my hands. They're actually very small hands. They, they, they Everything looks really big. I'm actually genuinely impressed with myself at how I managed to make it look like my desk has so much space. But it's there's there's not actually much space here, like at all. Like if you compare like my forearm to my hand, you'll see like how small it actually is. <laughs> but it's okay, I think it'll be enough space to show things off at least. And Sarah Cat, hello, Timochi, hello, Akira, hello, welcome, welcome. Uh, Susan May, hello, and Addy, hello. Yes, I, I, it is very late for you, so I fully understand if you have to go to bed, but wait, actually, but while you're here, da, 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 da. while you're here, I want to show off something that I got from Addy recently. We were like, we, we were exchanging K-pop photo cards recently as well, <laughs> and look at this. Look at this. Look how cute this is. Look how cute this is. <laughs> I love it so much. I just wanted to show it off. It's so, it's so pretty. It's so pretty. I love I love getting Addy out. I'm I'm blessed. I'm so blessed. But oh, you realize now you could have given Josh something to send to me while you were at Alfkai. Oh yeah. To be fair, it's merchandise stuff is always like really it's been like an adventure to get everything sorted and to also remember like what needs to be sent. Like the moments of like, okay, so we need to send this, this and this. Oh, but do we also need this? And what else was mentioned? Did you mention you wanted something else as well? And it gets really, <laughs> really complicated. 
<laughs> to remember what needs to be sent. But uh, I've, I've got a lot of stuff. Some of it is from off guy. Some of it is stuff I have just bought from the Studio Elan web store. Uh, I've got the without a voice Kickstarter stuff. That's something I really wanted to show off because uh, that arrived. I kept meaning to like tap, tap, tap. I keep, I <laughs> you'll be able to see just how much I fidget when I'm talking, when I have my hands out like this. But uh, I really wanted to show that off because I, I got that a little while ago. And I was like, I want to take really nice photos of this, so I'm not going to post about it yet. And th those photos just kind of haven't happened. <laughs> so I figured, why not just show them on camera? I, I, I think I need to turn off the autofocus. Because every time I move my hands, it's trying to like re-autofocus again. And it's a little distracting. Let's go manual focus. If, if I need to change the focus, I shall simply do it manually. Wait, how do I how do I disable this? Hold on. There. Okay. Now I can manually focus. Watch this. Whoa! <laughs> I have the power. Oh goodness, that's kind of terrifying. You can see like every pore in the gloves. That is terrifying. But now I can manually focus on everything. I'm not gonna have the the really awkward moments where I'm holding something up to the camera and being like, please focus, please focus. I can just do it myself. <laughs> That's so much better. That's much better. <laughs> but yes, I hope everyone's doing well. Happy Wednesday. Oh, actually, I, I, th I guess you can kind of tell by the grain on my desk that the space here isn't as big as it seems because the, the green is quite big. It's it's a it's a small space. <laughs> uh, Elian Eliano Elian Zero Blue. Let me know. Let me know what your name is. What I should call you. Thank you for the follow. Welcome on in. Welcome to handcam time. At the moment, it is just my hands. Like, medical hands. But yeah, so I've got my gloves on today. Uh, because I've got a lot of I've got a lot of plastic things. I've got a lot of things with like little peelies to peel off. I got a lot of plastic stuff, so I don't want to get loads of fingerprints over everything. But depending how things go, I, I might take the gloves off afterwards when I've got the stuff out. But I've got so many cool things to show off and I'm really excited for it. Oh, I'll just call you Blue. Okay, got it, Blue. Lovely to see you, welcome on in. I'm about to show off a whole bunch of stuff I've got, hopefully. Uh, so what should I start with? Wait, should I just show you the box of stuff I have? I could just put the whole box of stuff out. Who's ready to see my box of things? Here it is. My things. All of the stuff I want to share. It's all crammed into this box. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to have the box to the side and I'm just going to take things out of it. But uh, I think what I'm going to start with is the thing that I've had for the longest, I think, that I've not shared. I have this. <laughs> I have the, the limited run games version for the Switch of Heart of the Woods. This was, I, I don't remember when this was, it was a while ago, but I've had this for so long because as soon as I saw that there was like a, a limited run release of Heart of the Woods, I was like, well, I, I'm getting it. I'm, I'm not not getting it. I have it. I have to have it. I haven't even taken the cellophane off yet. <laughs> That's how behind on organizing my belongings I am. But it's so nice. It's so nice. Let's open it now. I can. The gloves might not be the most ideal for this, to be fair. No, I can do this. There we go. Oh, I saw a bit of the plastic come off and now I can't get it. <laughs> Here. I've got it. I've got it. <laughs> really? I've, I've not got it. Uh, hold on. 
Oh, isn't it the worst when you're trying to open something and you just pull off like a strip and then the rest of the packaging is still there? There we go. It is free. But look, out of the woods. On the switch. Oh. And it's got the reversible cover. It's got reversible cover. I love when things have reversible covers. Let's, let's have this cover. Let's turn it around. I love things with re reversible cover covers. Oh, I'm so I'm always so nervous changing them though, because I don't want to damage anything. I don't want to like rumple it. Look at that! Oh, it's so pretty! Ah, oh, I'm so happy. I'm I'm so happy. Let let her out. Free her. Free her from her orb. The snow globe. It's so pretty. I love the art. Oh, that was an Addy decision to make it a reversible rather than just an illustration on the inside. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I'm so glad. It's best decision. I'm so glad. Right, you know what I'm going to do actually with the music? I think I'm just going to put the... The one I started with this song, I think I'm just going to have this as the background music for a little bit because it feels like a a comfy hand cam stream BGM to have on. But uh, this is from the game Unpacking. So it feels quite appropriate for me unpacking all of my belongings. <laughs> but yeah, that that arrived ages ago. That was something I got ages ago. And I kept going, I'm going to take a nice photo of it. And then I never got around to taking the nice photo. And then the next things arrived. And I didn't take a photo of that. And then the next things arrived. And it's it's like, it's a constant thing for me. Because I always go, oh, I don't want to just take a, a rubbish photo. I want to take something nice and make a proper post about it. And then I just don't get the chance to actually do that. Or like, I'll try taking photos and they're all ugly. And I'm like, well, I don't want to post those. <laughs> but I want to get better at just like... Instead of trying to get like the perfect photo, I want to just take a photo and be like, look at this, look, just look at it. I'm not going to care so much if it's nice, if it's a nice photo or not. I'm just, I'm just going to be like, a photo shows the thing good enough for me. Anyway, on to the next thing, which I've had for a while and not shared. The next thing I have is another thing I've had for a while. How, how am I already getting bits on my desk? It's this. It's this. It's my Please Be Happy First Anniversary booklet. As soon as I saw the anniversary bundle, I instantly ordered it. And it is so nice. It is so lovely. I have a signed Mimo, signed by Dotobu. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So beautiful. I've got my Elan Festival ticket. <laughs> and it is so lovely. It's so lovely. Like, look at, look at this. It's so pretty. I love it. And there's an extra story as well. Which is really, really sweet. It's so lovely. It's so nice. I love it so much. And it also came with this beautiful standee as well. I've had this on my shelf for like half a year now. <laughs> as soon as it arrived, as soon as I got it, I've had this on my shelf. I, I immediately put it up there, but I still haven't like shared it. Oh, you can see my light. But I still haven't like taken photos of it. Wait, can you see me? You can kind of like vaguely see my face if I do that. Maybe I should put this like here. Not enough to make out detail, thankfully, but uh, hee hee, oopsie. <laughs> but it's so pretty. It is such a nice stand. It's, and it's so big too, like huge, huge stand. You can't really like see it there, but I'll put it there anyway. But it's so nice. 
It's so lovely. And I keep meaning to like take a really nice photo of everything together and not getting around to it because it's because I never do. Also, sweet note as well. Hello. Welcome, welcome. Welcome on in. Good morning. Welcome to me showing off all of the things I've bought in the past uh, eight months that I still haven't shared. Nine months. Longer than nine months. It's been a while. But I have so many, so many nice things. And I'm going to move on to another standee next as well because it is sat on top of my box of stuff. Another thing that when I got it, I instantly just assembled. It's the Verpro Studio Nekomata collaborative merch bundle standee. Look how cute this is. Look how cute it is. This is the cutest thing. I love it so much. It's so nice. It's got like layers to it. It's like there's the back level, which has got like the computer screen and it's like double sided too. You got the back of the computer there and then the background of the screen there. And then there's us. There is, there's Momoka, there's Mia, there's me, and there's Geist, and it's so cute. And then there's like the, the front of the PC, the, the front display for the PC, where we've got the, the flowers and cow for Momoka. We've got Sandra over here having a good time. We've got the, the laurel, laurel for, for Geist and cup of tea for Mia. And then at the front, we've got the keyboard and mouse, and it is so cute, it's so cute. It's so lovely, I love it so much. It This sits on my bedside table at the moment. <laughs> so every time I wake up, I look over and I'm like, oh yeah, look at that. It's so nice, it's really, really nice. And then also from the Studio Nekomata bundle, I also have t-shirts. T-shirts. I have not ironed them. I have not had the chance to iron them yet. I gave them a wash just to like after they arrived because I always do when I get new clothes. But they have not been ironed yet, so they are a bit creased. But this is the Momoka T-shirt. <laughs> Look how cute this is. It's so cute. It is so comfy. Like this T-shirt is so soft. It is so lovely. I love it so much. And then on the back, we got Momo in all her magical glory. Look at that. Oh, it's so pretty. It's so cute. It's such a lovely t-shirt. And uh, I ordered them like a little bit too big for me. Like they're oversized t-shirts and it's, I'm really glad I did. Because I know if I had ordered a small, it would fit me. But I ordered a medium for the t-shirts. And they're like that. It's like that perfect oversized fit where I can just like tuck it into my shorts or the skirt. And it's just like a little bit baggy on the top. And it's like really loose and comfortable. And I, I love them. I love them. They're such nice t-shirts. But that's not the only t-shirt I have. I have a second t-shirt. which is the Geist t-shirt with the onions. <laughs> Look at the little onions. It's so cute. It is so cute. I love the design so much. There's already cat fur on this. I'm, I'm doomed for eternity. There's so much cat fur. It's the only problem with black clothes, having a cat which has white fur. Her fur gets everywhere. But uh, this t-shirt too, the design on the back. Look at this, it's so pretty. It's so pretty. And then if anyone's wondering what this says as well, it is, um, it's Japanese for onion. It says tamanegi. It's, it's just, it's just the, the Japanese for onion. <laughs> and we got the lovely, the Geist silhouette portrait side view it is so pretty and also this t-shirt too i've not tested it myself yet i've not had the chance to actively test it but this t-shirt is glow in the dark the print on this is glow in the dark and i've seen photos 
that other people have taken that show how much it glows. It's incredible. <laughs> it's so cool having a glow in the dark t-shirt. But yeah, they're, they're just, they're so soft. That I'm, I'm really picky with t-shirts. I'm, I can't wear t-shirts if the material is too rigid or if it feels too stiff, but these are just so soft and comfortable. I, I love them. They're so nice. They're so good. But yes, that is two out of four of the Verpro Studio Nekamata merch bundle. Uh, the third one, um, Mia has a patch. She got like a an embroidered patch as her merch item. Sadly, I don't have that yet at the moment. Because when I... Oh, dropping frames. Oh, I don't, I don't... It seems okay on my end. It's... It is possible that my internet might go at some point because uh, internet in my whole area went down last night at like 2 a.m. I was trying to do like last minute stuff on the internet at two o'clock and then the internet just completely died and they didn't fix it until like 5 a.m. So uh, that was a fun time. But they said it, it was fixed, so I'm hoping it's fixed. So, oh uh, yeah, fingers crossed. I mean like, I was gonna say, fingers crossed it is just you. I Fingers crossed it just fixes itself and you don't have to worry about losing the internet and stuff. <laughs> but yeah, it's, it was like the, the weirdest moment. Just the internet just stopped working fully. So I went downstairs to see what was going on. I went to look at the router that we keep downstairs and I took a look at it and the little light for the internet was flashing red. And I've never seen it do that before. I was terrified. I, I was like, what is, why, I, why, why is it red? Why is it flashing? Why is it not just off if it's not working? What is wrong? And then my ISP was like, oh yeah, the, the whole area is down, sorry. We're fixing it as fast as we can. And credit to them as well. Like this was the middle of the night. They put out a message at like 4 a.m. that was like, okay, our engineers are going out right now at 4 a.m. And it was fixed by this morning. Like, incredible service. Like, I'm always really impressed. <laughs> but it was like just the, the terrifying moment of usually when the internet goes out, the router just like, the light just goes out. And it's just like, oh yeah, it's just not connected to the internet. This time it was like, it was flashing red and I was a little worried. <laughs> I was very glad when it was fixed again. Oh, your internet telling you to go to bed. Oh, well, it is a bit late. But hopefully if you do go to bed, you can get some good rest. Wait, before you go to bed, I, I was going to show off the rest of the Nekamata stuff very quickly, very quickly. Before you have to go. Ah, important stuff. rummaging through the box to try and find <laughs> to try and find all of my without a voice stuff hold on I think that's everything <laughs> I think this is all of it, but I got, I backed the Kickstarter, but without a voice. And I got the art book and I got all these lovely things. And I've got the physical version of the game. Beautiful, beautiful standee. It's gorgeous, gorgeous art. So pretty. This is also one where I've already peeled the, the plastic off. I've had this on my shelf for a little while. But it's so pretty. And this is so big as well. This is a huge standee. It's gorgeous. I love it. But yes, I backed the Kickstarter and I got this lovely keychain. Double sided. I've got pin. Rainbow metal pin. Oh, I forgot I have to manually focus things now. Hold on. I closed the thing I used to focus the camera because I'm silly. But yeah, there's the there's the pin. It's 
so pretty. But it's got like rainbow metal. You can kind of see it's like iridescent rainbow metal. There's cat fur everywhere. I am so sorry. But they're so pretty. They're so pretty. I love them. Yeah, a lo lovely keychain I totally don't already own. Do well. But yeah, you made those pins so long ago, like 2018. Yeah, like like this one I got in 2018. <laughs> I already had one. <laughs> I got the the first lot of the the merchandise. But it's so funny because with the 2018 one as well, I also got the the iridescent rainbow one. So I have two, I have two rainbow pins now. Also, I'm so sorry, like if I stop moving at any point, it's because I'm covering the, the tracking when I lift things up to the camera. <laughs> but they're so nice. But yeah, I also got this keychain too, which is lovely, but um, I also already had these from, from 2018. <laughs> I already had to. <laughs> so now I have three. But it's really interesting too. Because these are like the original ones. The first wave. First wave of the keychains. But now. Now it is gold and shiny and bigger and it is so lovely. Oh wait, that's one of my hairs. My apologies. <laughs> Just a random pink hair that wants to enter the enter the view. But yes, yeah, so pretty. But it's also really interesting because these are the new keychain is also bigger than the old ones. Like, look at the size difference. And also, like, the print is darker on these ones. This one is so much clearer. It's so much clearer and brighter. It's it's like the little keychain upgrade. <laughs> it's so nice. Yeah, just being Addy long-term friends things. Should I get my Addy box out? <laughs> no, I won't do that. I've, but I've, I've, I always, it's so wild to think of how long we've been friends for because I have so many things made by you. I've got all like the exclusive before the Studio Elan Times stuff. It's really nice though, but it's like the, the whole Kickstarter set is so, so lovely. I'm like, do, 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 do. If I open this, we'll have a look. Also, Brinley, I just realized I didn't say hi to you. I missed your message. Hello. Welcome, welcome. Welcome to the show off stream. Look. There's cards. I love photo cards. I love photo cards. Oh, they're so nice. I'm so happy to have this. I'm so happy to have this. I love it so much. I love it. Oh, the the phone charms. Uh, I actually added those myself. <laughs> it's like I. I don't remember what happened. I I think they did come with silver charms originally, but some of the one of them fell off, and then I took the other one off so I could make them match with the phone straps. <laughs> but no, they didn't originally come with these. I just added that. But yeah, I'm I'm so glad I have this. This is my my favorite ending. I love this one. I love this one. It's so pretty. Oh, it's so nice. And look at the shiny sticker shiny sticker it's so pretty i got the postcard everything i have is so shiny i i feel like i should have put a face mask on or something Blink. beautiful postcards ah oh, it's so they're so so pretty look at them they're gorgeous oh the I am I'm such a sucker for the red string of fate. I I love the string of fate. That's a thing. Oh, it's so pretty. It's so pretty. 
I love them. They're so gorgeous. I love me some Addy art. Not that anyone would ever guess looking at my model drawn by Addy. <laughs> but oh, they were maybe lavender straps originally. Oh, but oh, you had to put them on each one manually. Oh, I see. That would make sense. But to be fair, like, it seems like the original rings are still on them. I think I just replaced them myself because I was like, I want the darker ones. But yeah, it's so nice. And the art book too, I won't go through the whole thing. I'll just have like a little flick through. But it's so nice. It's so nice having the, the physical copy of this. Because I've... I've already looked through it multiple times. Like I had the PDF, the digital file for the art book, but I feel like there's something so special about physically holding an art book in your hands. Like I, I love it. I love them. It's so nice. It's so nice. I love it so much. It's so lovely. And then there's the physical, physical edition of the game with the companion booklet. It's so nice. And this is also reversible. <laughs> also reversible cover. I love it. But I, I keep it on this one because I, I feel like this feels like the covery cover to me. But it's so nice. <laughs> oh, you have like home printer versions of the art book. Oh, Print off your own version. But yeah, it's like when it's like professionally printed and bound and it's just so lovely. It's it's just, it is a, a book you can hold on to. It's so nice. It's so nice. A game manual has surprise inside too. Ba, 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 ba. Oh yeah, the short story. Yeah, oh, this is so pretty. It's so pretty. Oh, I love it all. I love it so much. And oh, hey, let's check out the other Bell House titles. What, what, what could these possibly be? I've already played two out of three of these. <laughs> yeah. But I still need to get around to actually playing without a voice on stream. Because I played this a million years ago, like before it was even on Steam. <laughs> It's so nice. It's so nice. Oh, fun little thing for the Elan PC cases you design. Uh, all colorful spine version and white spine version. Oh, that's really cool. Oh yeah, I didn't notice because that's got the white spine, but then this side has the the pattern design spine. But I, I like having it with the spine like this. I feel like it looks nice on the shelf. <laughs> But oh, it's so, it's so lovely. It's so lovely to own it all. Such a lovely, lovely set. I'm so glad I backed the Kickstarter. And got all the little extras to go with it. But yes, that is so nice. And I've, I've been meaning to take photos of it all for so long and just have not gotten around to it. So now I've just shown them off on, on hand cam instead. It's perfect. Ha. Ah, right. What next? Oh, well, what next would be the rest of the Nekomata bundle? Because you may notice, I've shown the Momoka merch. I've shown the Geist merch. I've mentioned the Mia merch, which I don't have yet, but it's being sent to me. Because it wasn't ready by the time Ofkai happened, and my, my merch was given to me, like, as handed over at Ofkai to send to me. So the Mia patch is still on the way, but I've also done the, the group standee and Leary, you may say, what about your own merchandise? To which I say, it's somewhere in this box, hold on. <laughs> ha. <laughs> Leary magnets! Leary magnets are real! They're so good! They're so good! They're bigger than I thought they were going to be. I don't know... I don't know what I was expecting. 
but they're they're bigger than I thought they would be, and they stick so well as well. I've actually got one stuck on my radiator right now, and I I don't think monster cans are magnetic. Now, do I have any metal? I don't think I have anything magnetic I could stick this to at the moment, but it it sticks very well. But it's so pretty. Look how pretty it is. I love the the Studio Nekomata merch bundle has been so lovely. It's been so pretty. Like, look, it's gorgeous. It's so nice. I love it. PC case, I am not going to stick a magnet close to the parts of my PC. <laughs> that sounds like a recipe for disaster to me. I don't want magnets near my hard drives. <laughs> But it's so lovely. Oh, I could just like, I could prop it up here. Inside the stand. In front of this PC, this PC will do. <laughs> but it's so nice. I love it. It's such a lovely merch bundle. I'm, I'm so glad we got the chance to work with Studio Nekomata because they, they all make such amazing stuff. They are such great artists and designers. They're so good. They're so good. And, like, I I really would love to do, like, a full bundle with them, like, just me. Like, after doing the, the Verpro bundle, a little part of me is now, like, imagine if if I could have that all, all for me. <laughs> that would be really nice at some point in the future. But it's, it's so gorgeous. It's such nice merch. And I'm so happy about it. But speaking of merch... Speaking of me, <laughs> I have more things to show off. my anniversary match it's my anniversary match honestly my my webcam does not do these justice these standees are so beautiful they are so lovely i am so blessed i'm so blessed i love them so much but yes, I finally got my own anniversary merch bundles. And hilariously enough, as I was sorting through everything to get ready for the stream today, I was like, oh, let me find out my signed postcard as well to show that off on the screen. Um, I don't know what I've done with it. I've, I have misplaced my own signed postcard. I don't know what happened. I don't know where it is. I don't know what I've done. To it i don't know where it is but wherever it is it is hiding somewhere along with my verpro eats postcard and i don't know what i've done with them i was i was like searching searching for like a good hour <laughs> before the stream trying to find them and i couldn't find them i just can't find them anywhere i i know i have them i know they are here somewhere i just don't know where they are it is so wild like I've I've genuinely like turned my room upside down trying to figure out where I put them and I, I have no idea but it's okay because I borrowed the one I gave my brother <laughs> I signed one for my brother so I was like I will borrow that to show off what the postcard looks like but I lost my own <laughs> it's somewhere I'm I'm, I, I really feel like I'm gonna find it the second the stream ends. As soon as the stream ends, I'm gonna walk out of my room and spot them lying on a side or something. But it's okay. But yes, for everybody who ordered an anniversary merchandise bundle, I did signed postcards. I signed them all. And uh, if you didn't specify anything in the notes, I just wrote a little thank you and put some hearts. But if you specified a name, I wrote your name on it. 
so they're special postcards, which is also Addy art. <laughs> but they're so lovely. But this is only half of the bundle. There is more. There is more as part of the anniversary bundle. There is. Do -do 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 sticker book. This is my sticker book. Look how pretty this is. Look how pretty this is. Like the front art and the back art. It's it's so pretty. The little chippies. It's so cute. But this is not a notebook. This is special because this is a stick of... Oh my god! That, oh, that's that's like that's spoilers for the merch I'm showing later. Oh my goodness, I, they're both here. They're both. <laughs> oh, I, oh my god, I'm. <laughs> I can't believe myself. I cannot believe this. I. My room is a nightmare. My bedroom at the moment. I've I turned it upside down trying to find these. It is a state. And they're just here. They were just tucked in here. I can't. Why am I like this? Why am I like this? Anyway, there's, there's the thank you. <laughs> Do a little cat face. But that's the thank you postcard. <laughs> I can't believe it. <laughs> I am very smart and clever. Honestly, like, it was very smart of me to took to tuck them into the notebook so that they don't like get bent or get folded or anything. That was like a really smart move for me to do. I can't believe this. I'm... Anyway, look at the Verpro Eats postcard. It's so cute. I'll get onto that in a second. I will get the, the keychains for that in a second as well. But first... Stickers. It's a sticker book. It's a sticker book, and the way this works is, it's not a normal book. It has got shiny pages, like the back of a sticker sheet. Like, this material is the same as this material. So basically, what you can do is, you can get a sticker, like this lovely Tiffy. You can get a Tiffy. You can stick it. You can stick it in the book. There she is! And then, if you decide you want it somewhere else, you can just peel it out. Put it somewhere else. It's like sticker storage. You can peel it out and put it somewhere else. Obviously, don't do it too much because stickers will lose their stickiness as time goes on. You can't just, like, do it endlessly. But I've got to say, there is something so fun about just like sticking a sticker in and then taking it out and then putting it back in again. It's very, very fun. And look, we got the big fire sticker. I love this one. I love how this sticker turned out. I think it's so funny. Hold on, let me... Look at... It's so perfect. It's so great. I love it. But yeah, I love having a sticker book because this way, this way it's like, there's a way to display your stickers. But if you are like me and you always feel like it's too much of a commitment to stick something down in case you might want to stick it somewhere else later, it's like fully no commitment. You can pull them back out afterwards. You can use them in other situations. Get a little cheer, go woo! They're so good. They're so good. But I I love it so much. It's like the, the whole reason I wanted a sticker book, I will fully disclose this right now. It was because I wanted one. I really wanted a sticker book of my own because I get so many stickers. 
and I kind of just leave them on their sheets because I don't want to use them. But with a sticker book like this, I feel like I can display them, like I can make little pages with stickers and have like sticker displays while still knowing that if I want to use those stickers later on, I can just peel them out again and put them somewhere else. So it's really nice. Hold on, let me, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to stick all of these in the book. I don't know where. I don't know how I'm going to arrange them, but that's okay. I can figure it out. But, oh, Tim, hi. Uh, you just had a funny little thing happen. You told Alexa to play 4K bird video for cats. And it started playing a donkey bird pod. <laughs> Wait, I love that. That's great. But uh, hello, welcome, welcome. But yeah, I feel like you'll never use the Leary sticker book just to ha due to how you just never use stickers. No, but that's the joy of it. Like this can be how you use stickers. If you usually just keep them on the sheets because you want to have them, then you can have a, a new fun way to dis display them instead. Let's move this. I kind of just like plonk this in the middle of the page. But that's so cute. I love it. I love how the stickers turned out because they're, they're so bright and colorful as well. I feel like my webcam definitely doesn't do the best job of displaying how beautiful the colors are on these. But they're so nice. Okay, that one's a little wobbly, but I'll fix it afterwards. But I just, I just really like stickers. I am, um, if I ever go to a convention and I want to get merchandise and I don't know what to get, I feel like a lot of people I know go for art prints. I go for stickers. I will always choose stickers over art prints. I just really love stickers. Like, I love art prints as well, but stickers, I'm... I always feel like I'm more likely to, to use them because I love sticking stickers on things. <laughs> oh. Head bop. Head bonk. And a boop. Yeah, these aren't like super aligned. Oh, actually, they're they're neater than I thought. I'm doing a better job of placing these than I thought I was. <laughs> but I just I just really like stickers. I'm a big fan of stickers. I think they're very very good. <laughs> and it's like whenever I buy stickers, do I usually buy. Like, if it's a sticker sheet, I will buy more than one sheet. And I'll keep one as, like, the merchandise to look after. And then I'll just stick the other sheet everywhere. I'll, I'll just sticker bomb everything I own. Like, there is not a single thing I own that's, like, a, a solid thing that can have stickers on that I have not stuck loads of stickers on. Like, my PC case, side of my PC case is fully covered in stickers. It is just plastered in stickers and I love it because every time I look at it I always spot them and I'm like oh yeah yeah my favorite things look I see them all and it's so nice oh that was wonky <laughs> oh it was very wonky that's fine that's fine so you know what we can do we can just unstick it and stick it back in again a little wonky that's fine oh you like to put stickers on the cover of the portfolio books you bought to store your art prints in yeah that's the best way to do it like then then you get both then you get both look at that <laughs> walk away for like three minutes and come back to half the stickers gone yeah I'm, I'm i'm starting my sticker book the way it should be and then if anyone was wondering why i have these it's because I am a little bit silly and I thought, wouldn't it be funny if I did something like this? <laughs> and you can make your own little flip book <laughs> with my stickers. <laughs> so if anyone's curious, that's, that's the reason why there's six of these, because I wanted to do this. Like this. 
Make a make a little pop cat. <laughs> you did the same thing. I'm so glad. I'm so glad. It's so cute. Also, Sanya Mita, hello. Thank you for the hydrate and posture check. I will stick this last sticker on. Goodbye. Empty sticker sheet. And so now, if I got this, we can get. <laughs> Popcat. Oh, I, I, I skipped through like both of them like that. There we go. But it. <laughs> Isn't it cute? It's so cute. I love it. I love my stickers. Hold on. You, we could fill up a bit more space with these. Ba -ba -bam. You can go... Boom. Boom. There we go. That'll do nicely for now. Until I get more stickers. But yeah, my sticker book. I love it so much. It turned out so nicely. But Sanya Mita, thank you for the hydrate and posture check. I will have a sip of my monster. And I will have a big stretch. A big stretch. Stretch my arms out. As far as they can go. <laughs> but welcome, welcome. This is so cute. Hi, Luna, isn't it? I'm, I'm showing off my merch. I'm, I love it so much. Uh, it's a funny story. I got this postcard. This was the one I signed for my brother. I got this out because I couldn't find my thank you one for myself. I had tucked it inside my sticker book and I didn't realize until I opened it on stream. So I'm a very smart person who makes very smart decisions. But uh, this is my merch. This is my anniversary merch bundle. And I, it's so lovely. It's so nice. Look, it's my sticker book. It's my stickers. You can unpeel them and put them back in again. I love them. I love it so much. I love how everything turned out. It's, it's so beautiful. And like, look how cute this is as well. It's like... I really loved the chance to do this merch bundle because I got to work with two of my best friends who are my two artists. <laughs> like everything is um, like this is all the the Addy side of the, the merch bundle. We've got the postcard and the standees and they are so gorgeous. And then this is the ghost aficionado side of the bundle, which is the sticker book with the cute chibis and the cute front and the stickies. And uh, he's my emote artist. He's the one who does all my emotes. So I'm really glad I got to work with both sides, like model artist, emote artist, to to have like the whole bundle, like the whole set. It's so nice, it's so nice. But hi, Bon, welcome, welcome. It is so pretty and nice. And like the, the print is so lovely too. It's like, hold on. They're so cute. They're so cute. And the logo as well. Addy did the logo too. So the, the, collab, the collaboration continues. <laughs> but it's so nice. It's so nice. Everything shows up like slightly bluer on my webcam for some reason, which is something I've not been able to fix even with like white balance stuff, but that's okay. But yeah, they're so nice. I just, I love how it all turned out. It's. So gorgeous. Hold on, let me try and get the peelies off here. If I can. Might have to take the gloves off for this. I'll leave the peelies until afterwards. <laughs> but I'm just, I'm, I'm so over the moon with how beautifully everything came out. Because it's, 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 I've always wanted merch of myself like when I started streaming it always felt like so far off it felt like such a distant goal like oh people won't buy merchandise of me there's no there's no reason to make merch nobody will get that and now look at me three years on selling all of these merch bundles with the most gorgeous stuff loveliest things and it's so nice it is like the nicest thing 
I love it. I love it so much. Thank you for the head pat as well. But yeah, it's so great. I love it. Right, can I like... Oh, you know what I'll do actually? You know what I'll do? Page two. Shiny sticker. Yes! Sticker book in use. The first sticker that is not my own that has been added to the sticker book. It's without a voice. It's so nice. I love it. I love it so much. Right, what I'm going to do actually is I'm going to move these down to here. Because then I think I can stack that. And I can also stack these and I can keep it there. Like that, yeah. Right, so next up, I should probably go for this. Let's find these out. In my little box of tricks. Oh, I forgot. Also, Studio Nekamata. The postcard! Signed postcard, signed by the Verpros. Everyone else used a normal pen and I got a Sharpie out apparently, but uh... <laughs> oh, I forgot it doesn't autofocus. But look, we all signed it. It's so nice. I love seeing the signatures, but it's so sweet. That's another part of the Studio Nekamata bundle. So I'll put that over here with this stuff. And also this, this was a gift from Fairy Co. Look, she drew me, this was like, this was drawn a while ago when I was doing an Animal Crossing stream and she drew me Animal Crossing style. And I was always just like, I love this art. It's so cute, thank you. And then lo and behold, I get my merch bundle. This was added. I had no idea this was, like, this is like, this was just a gift for me and it's so cute, it's so cute. You know what, you can go in the sticker book as well. More stickers for the sticker book! It's so exciting! <laughs> oh, if I can even peel it off. Hello? Oh. oh, there for a second. Got it, got it, nope. It keeps pinging back. Oh, there we go. Ha! Sticker! Oh, it's, it's so cute. <laughs> it's so cute. I love it. I love my sticker book. I'm so happy to have a sticker book. It's good. Right, anyway. Burpro Eats! Look how cute these are. They're so cute. I can't find anything. I'm so unprepared for this stream, but it's okay. <laughs> we have a Momo. We have a Sylphie! We have a Geist! We have this, this weirdo. And we have a Mia! <laughs> they're, they're so cute! They're so cute! Although it's so funny because Mama's turned out smaller because her ponytails are so big. Her ponytails are so massive that it ended up being like the size of the cubes. 
<laughs> it made her small. Which is so funny, considering I'm pretty sure canonically Momo is the tallest of us all. <laughs> we get a small Momo, she was too powerful. But they're so cute, I love it. But it's so lovely because mom was here with her little macaron. We have Silphy with the takoyaki. We have Geist with the, the bubble donut. Which also kind of looks like a baby toy. It kind of looks like a baby teething toy. So that also kind of works. And I, I have the dinosaur nugget, of course. Everyone else is here with like these sophisticated foods that you would buy from like a stand or a restaurant and I'm just here like, what if dinosaur nuggets? <laughs> a meal of champions. And Mia has a crepe and it looks so lovely. It all looks so yummy. But look at us, we're all having our meal. Truly a feast. I feel like this is truly the most wonderful feast. Yeah, I'd, I'd enjoy a dinner of just this. It's we've, we've you've got everything you need. You've got um sugar, dinosaur nuggets. Octopus. Yeah, I can't think of anything else you need. <laughs> but they're so cute. And I love how we all have like the little different color keychains too. It looks so nice. It's like, it's so nice how we managed to find like the blue keychain that matches Momo's outfit so perfectly. Because as we were like, when we were planning making these, me and Momo were both just sat like, uh, it's okay, you can have the pink one. No, it's okay, you can have the pink one. Because we were talking about how it would be nice for all of them to be different colors. But of course, we are both very pink. <laughs> so I was just there like, it's okay, you can have the pink one. But then when we were like, I think I ended up actually just like getting images of the keychains and like photoshopping them next to the art. And as I did that, we were like, wait, that blue actually matches perfectly. Maybe, maybe. So then I got the pink. <laughs> Cause the, the only other options as well were like, there was like blue and there was like this mint green, but there wasn't like a tealy option, like an in between these shades. So this would have been like too green for me, I think. And this one would have been too blue. So I'd, I'd have needed something like in between. So going with the pink just made sense. Truly the real Last Supper. No, this is not the Last Supper because we're going to have more. <laughs> it's not the Last Supper. We're going to keep having this supper. We're not stopping at one. I've got way more dinosaur nuggets. But yeah, they're so, so cute too. And I'd, I'm so glad I did find the postcard too because I, I was so worried trying to find it earlier. I genuinely had no idea where I could have put it. I was so anxious. Like, I, I please don't let me have lost it. But it's, it's so pretty. It's so pretty. I love it. I love it all. Right, I'm, I've, got, I've got too much stuff to like keep on my desk now. I may have to start moving things to the side. Hmm. Hold on, also, I'm gonna turn my fan on a bit too, so apologies if you hear a slight fan sound in the distance. But I'm getting a bit warm and I didn't manage to set up my AC properly because of the aforementioned state of my bedroom right now. <laughs> it's, it's a mess, it's very messy, I gotta tidy it. I gotta tidy it. I've gotta, it's, it's less tidying than more like, I just need to clear space. I need to find spots to put everything because my main problem at the moment is I keep buying things and I have nowhere to put them. So then I need to rearrange stuff to find places to put the new things. And I haven't gotten around to that rearranging yet. So the new things kind of just stay in piles on the floor <laughs> until I can find a space for them. But I have like three or four piles of items on my floor at the moment and it's it's getting past the point where I should have put them away by now. I I should have put them away. Yet I did not, because I'm a I'm a smart person who makes smart decisions. 
but oh another thing too I don't know if Addie's still here or if she went to bed already but I also have curiosity keychain it's curiosity from summer uni but with the verpro logo in the background it's the the verpro collaboration and it's so cute it's so cute I love it so much also, Broily, hello! Welcome, welcome! <laughs> You're still here, but you should sleep. Understandable. Yes, you, look at this before you sleep. Have have good dreams. Look, this is so cute. It's so cute. I love them. I love them so much. Love them. So cute. Yeah, holding a little purple heart, too. You can see the little heart. It's so cute. I love it so much. I have so many really nice keychains. I want to do what Momo's done. Uh, Momo recently showed off. She's got like pin boards that she's put all of her merchandise stuff onto. And it's so nicely displayed. It looks so lovely. And I want to do that myself as well. I also want to like organize my own pin board and like have all of my keychains up on the, the pin board looking nice. So I've got a nice display of them. But uh, to do that, I need to organize everything first. I need to get everything ready first. So that's like the main priority. The main priority is sorting out my piles of stuff, finding places for them. And then in doing so, I will have sorted out all of my keychains and I can prepare to start putting them on my pin board. <laughs> but they're so nice. That's so lovely. Right, what should I get out next? Oh, I know what to get out next. Twofold. Twofold time. So, uh, anyone who has been here on Tuesdays recently will know that I have been very much enjoying Twofold. So, I decided, with all the merch stuff being sent to me, I was like, I'm going to make a little order of my own. And I'm gonna buy... Caprice, where are you? Boom! And here are all the other parts that go with them for the rest of the stands. But I got the two-fold standees and they're so pretty. They're so nice. Wait, where's the Caprice background? Here it is. Caprice! But they're so nice. I still haven't peeled all the plastic off and set these up yet. But I also got the art book. And it's so nice. It's so lovely. It's so lovely. I love it so much. It's so pretty. I haven't fully looked through it yet. Because I don't want to spoil myself because I haven't done Caprice's route yet. So I haven't actually like looked through it yet. I've just gone like this. But I'm really excited for when I finish and I can like fully look through it because it's, it's so pretty, so pretty. And then I also have, I also have this. I got Charlie. <laughs> look at the smile, look at that. It's so pretty. It's so pretty. And then also, I have this. I have Olive and I have it signed by Dotovu. <laughs> I have it signed by the voice of Olive as well. It's so, so nice. It's so pretty. It's so, it feels so special to me. Hold on, where's my, where's my flappy bappy happy one as well? Hold on. Here it is. I've got them 
both signed by Dotavu. Look at that. It's so nice. So nice. Olive looks dead? What? No, they look serene. They look at peace, which is what they deserve after all of the stress of Twofold, honestly. It's so pretty. It's so gorgeous. I love them. I love it so much. I love having it. <laughs> oh, that is a lie. They're fine. They're alive. They're thriving. They're cooking delicious food right now. How dare you? It's a funeral casket pose. No, it's not. They're, they're holding a heart. They're holding a flower to their heart. That's if I did a pose of me with my eyes shut holding a flower to my heart, the, the, I, I would hope people wouldn't immediately go, oh yeah, funeral casket. <laughs> see, I look at it and I just see like peace and serenity. It just feels like really calm and lovely to me. <laughs> Isn't that interesting how people perceive things in different ways? Oh yeah, and I also have this. I have a Millie. I have a Millie keychain, but I don't have a Caprice because they sold out. <laughs> but it's okay. Oh, I just realized as well, I forgot with my own merch bundle too. This too, you get a worm on a string. <laughs> I have twofold card. It's so cute. It's so nice. But yes, I'm I'm so happy to be playing twofold. I'm I'm loving it so much. It's so good. Oh wait, I'm pretty sure I have some stickers too though, actually. Hold on. Hold on, because I'm pretty sure Josh gave me some stickers. Some twofold stickers. I need to find I need to find them. Oh no, it's not just twofold, it's just little stickers, little stickers I was given, but the snow, Alison and Eileen sticker, and without a voice sticker, happy my love, yes, very much so, <laughs> and twofold sticker, <gasps> look, at, look at that, look at that. That's an olive. So yeah, I have more stickers. Wait, you know what this means. More stickers, they gotta go in the sticker book. Right, in you go. Alison and Eileen can go at the top, I think. Goodness. This is so hard. I may just take the gloves off, actually. I'm just gonna remove the gloves. I apologize, I'm gonna get my bare hands out. Bare hands, but you're a cat. <laughs> Hold on a sec. Actually, my hands are a little bit sweaty because of having the gloves on. Maybe I won't. Hold on. a second the hands will return soon I apologize oh, hold on. Do, I, do I have a towel in here yeah I, I do have a towel but yeah I think having the the gloves on it's like I like having the gloves so that I don't leave like little fingerprint marks on everything but also they stifle my hands so much. They make my hands really sweaty and it's not nice. So I'm just just grabbing a wipe to wipe my hands off. And we're gonna leave the gloves. I'm not gonna have the gloves on. You get to see my, my hands without gloves. Oh, hold on, my hands feel so nasty now, though. I'm getting another wipe. Ha! 
as you can tell, I was very prepared for today's stream. Man, it's so funny because like I had the idea for a while. I was like, I would love to do a hand cam stream where I'm just showing off everything I have. I can organize that quite well. I can make that quite easily. And then instead of like actually preparing everything the way I should have, I was running around like a headless chicken trying to find this postcard which was actually tucked inside my notebook the whole time. And I wasted so much time looking for those silly postcards. And I didn't actually prepare everything I meant to. So I'm, I'm, I'm clever and smart. But it's okay because today is meant to be a, a chill day anyway. We're just relaxing. Slow pace, no pace. Doesn't matter how long it takes me. There is no time limit today. Oh, it's wild how just having gloves on for an hour makes my hands feel so bleh. Da, 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 da. There we go. Almost. Okay. Hello! I got hands. They're really red because of how, like, warm and stifled they got <laughs> in the gloves. But I got my hands out now. Hi. Hello! The gloves are gone. Now I can hopefully unpeel these a bit easier. <laughs> in theory. In theory, I can unpeel them easier. It's not actually going to turn out that way, I can tell. Don't you... There, there. Got it. Ha ha! Oh, it's so, so cute. It's so cute. I love these stickers so much. And then we'll do this one next. We'll put the without a voice next to without a voice. And I go... Ablom. And twofold. But um, yeah, more stickers for the sticker book. I love my sticker book. I love it so much. It is a good book. Right. Anyway, I've got all these lovely standees, and so far, uh, I've peeled the plastic off. Oh, I just knocked the keychain off. Oopsie. It's fine. I've peeled the plastic off the Caprice ones. I've tried to set up Caprice, but... It's got lots of bits on it. Ba -da -boom. Ta -da. Does it go like that? Hmm. Yeah, I think it goes like that. It kind of covers up the name a little bit. But uh, there's Caprice! With her little megaphone with her hat on. Let's get Haley next. Ba -ba -ba -ba. It's time to peel off the plastic. One of my favorite parts of getting things like acrylic stands and keychains and stuff, I really love pulling the, the protective film off. It is very satisfying. Also, Sarah Cat, hello! How's the stream going? Um, I had to take my gloves off because my hands were getting uncomfortable. So I've got my, my bare hands out now. My cat hands, my human hands. This is the girl part of Cat Girl. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Get that off. Next one this side like if you if you look at this if i focus in on this you can see like the plastic has gotten really damaged like this this right here this is why these stands have the protective films 
these are all like bumps and scratches that would have damaged the stand if that protective film had not been there. But because it's here, it means I can peel it off and the stand itself is fine. Also Vastsut, hello! Did you know it's Women Wednesday? It is indeed, it is Women Wednesday and I've got so many women right here. It's so good. It's the perfect time for a merch reveal, honestly. But yeah, that was a really satisfying peel. That was a very nice one. I can't seem to get the edge of this one. Oh, come on. I can't get it. I almost got it. I've almost got it. There we go. Oh, it, it, it tore a bit here. Now we're fine. Here we go. Oh, yes. There it goes. And then if I show you show you the focus again, look, it's perfect. Perfect condition, not a scratch. That is why the protective films exist. That is why they have a protective coat on. It's to prevent against all of these little scratches and bangs and knocks that would damage the thing. Like you see it all there, you can see how, how damaged it would have gotten without the film. But because it is protected, it is fine. Oh, for you, every day is Women Wednesday, but the government doesn't like it when you do that. <laughs> Why can't every day be Women Wednesday? Well, you know what you can do? You can do what I say. Uh, Yuri Day is every day that ends with a Y. If the day ends with a Y, then it's time for Yuri. That's, that's what I always say. Oh my goodness, it's... <laughs> I love the protective films and they do such a good job of protecting the plastic, but these ones do not want to come off. These ones really don't want to peel off. Oh, there we go. Ah, oh, yes. Got it. And the other side. You know what, I'm gonna change the song. Let's put this one on. Bum, 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 bum. Let's do that. Ah, oh. oh, yes, there we go. And now we get the back. The back of the Haley one. Look at it, it's so cute. I love them so much. I love the design. I feel like all of the design elements in Twofold are just chef's kiss. They're so lovely. Oh, you posted a picture of your Haley and Lurie standing in the Discord. Oh, I'm so glad. Thank you. I'll have to look at that in a second. Oh, I keep, I keep like knocking my desk and knocking the camera attached to my desk. Here we go. Oh yes, there we go. Haha. <laughs> Sorry, Millie. I knocked the Millie gearing off the <laughs> Haley. And just the back. Oh, this one's already yes. Yes. Oh, fabulous. One down, three to go. I, I say one down because I already. I already peeled all the plastic off the Caprice one. Up <laughs> we go, bada boom. Hold on. Oh yeah, it's this way. Sorry, I had to use some force to get that back in. I'm guessing myself now. Is this the right way around? Is it this way? This way. This way, because then you can actually see her name. There we go. 
We have a Haley. Haley. Yeah, it's no, it's a, a twofold Tuesday. Women Wednesday. If I wanted to do Thursday as well, that would also be twofold Thursday because it still begins with a T. It just works every day of the week, right? And here's the olive one. The olive one has like the little trolley car, the Quinn and the salt and pepper shakers. I love it. I love this. I love it all so much. Oh, you need more bookshelves for all the women. Me too. I need more places to display things. Oh, it's so nice when it all just comes off like that. Oh, it's so satisfying. But yeah, I need more shelves as well. To put all my things on. Because I have so many nice things now and I want to display them all. It's like... It's okay owning things and then putting them away. I don't want to put them away. I want them all to be on display. I want to show them all off. Whoop. There's the olive background. Oh, this is your first time seeing non-gloved hands. Yeah, I had to take the gloves off. Oh, Caprice fell over. It's fine. I had to take the gloves off because my hands were getting really stifled. So you get to just see my hands. They're a little less red now. They were so red when I first took the gloves off. They're less red now, but uh, you can you can see how pale I am by the fact you can just see my veins so clearly. I'm so pale. Oh no, you're immersion. I I'm I'm pale. I've I've always talked about how pale I am. Also, I have a, a little a little freckle on my ring finger. I remembered seeing a thing online a while ago, like just like a silly like Facebook post or something. And it was like, uh, wherever you have freckles on your body, that's how you died in a previous life. And I'm like, what, do, what does that imply about me if I have one on my ring finger? <laughs> Maybe I never get married. <laughs> now let's get the rest of the olive stand up. Oh, that means my future wife is a freckle faced cutie. Wait, I like that actually. I like that interpretation. I'm going to accept that one. That is, that's a much nicer interpretation for it. I like that. Hey. Oh, I guess it didn't want to loop the song. I guess we're just listening to this one. Hee <laughs> hee. Oh, died by the inside of your left thumb and your right knuckle. <laughs> Yeah, it's like, it's it's not a thing that really makes much sense. It is a silly little, like, Facebook post made for engagement. It, it's meant for people to reply going, but that doesn't work because that's how they get the engagement. It's like the, the it's like when they post those things and it's like, hey, check out this uh, word search. You'll never find the hidden word. And it's like the most obvious thing in the world. But they do that on purpose. They make it really obvious because they know then that all of the Facebook moms will see it and they'll be like, well, I see the word. I feel smart. I'm going to comment. And so the more people comment, the more it gets pushed up in the algorithm. The more people see it, the more people comment. It is just engagement farming. And, <laughs> and my mom falls for it every time. <laughs> also, Gigi, hello. Welcome, welcome. Welcome on in. I got hands. I got hands. I'm peeling peelies off of my my merchandise at the moment. Welcome, welcome, and welcome Narava as well. Yeah, only two percent can solve this puzzle. They always word it like that so that when you manage to solve it, you feel really smart, and so you want to share it. But it's it's always like the the most obvious stuff. It's the most obvious stuff. Wait, Gigi, you're right. I'm peeling an olive. <laughs> I'm peeling an olive. Woohoo! There they are. I love them. I love them so much. <laughs> oh, I've been seeing loads of engagement farming on Twitter. Oh, it's it's just always a thing on the internet. It's the kind of thing where you, you can't stop it. You can just, like, not not boost it yourself like just 
whenever I see something, I'm just like, yeah, I scroll down. I think my favorite, like, engagement farming to just, like, look at and scroll past on Twitter at the moment is when there's always people who are, like, doing the, the VTuber post your PNG posts. And it's like, hey, I want to find more VTubers. Drop your PNG here. And nobody ever actually does anything. Nobody ever actually follows anyone else from those posts. It is all pure engagement farming. But it's still very sweet seeing people's PNGs, so I don't mind it. <laughs> but it's such a weird spot, because it always feels so... Like, there's a little part of it I don't like when people are like, oh, I want more people to follow, post your PNG here. And then you, like, make a note of their following count, and it doesn't change at all before and after the post. It's like, ah, I see, you just wanted loads of people to comment on your tweet. I see. But it's okay. It's like, in the grand scheme of problems in the world, it doesn't matter. It really doesn't matter. <laughs> so I'm just, so I just scroll on by. Oh my goodness, I can't get Olive in the base. They won't go in the base, no. Is there like plastic inside this bit? Kind of looks like there might be. That's not ideal. Hmm. This is that squeak. The squeak as I'm trying to like lever it into the thing. Did I peel the base? Yeah, I did. I peeled all of it. Both sides. Both sides of olive. Both sides of the base. It's not going in. I think that's okay. Yeah, it doesn't want to go in. Oh my goodness. It's fine. It's fine. Okay. Yeah, it's it's gone in enough that so long as I don't like knock it over, it should be fine. But we got him! We got a Haley, we got an Olive, we got a Capiche. And we got Millie! Millie last but definitely not least. <laughs> yeah, exactly the I want more raid targets, drop your link below. And you know they're not gonna click the link, but it's it's like I don't I don't mind so much. It's just I do side-eye it a little bit. <laughs> but I always like seeing other VTubers' designs and stuff too. I really like the PNG posts. Like sometimes I'll just click into them just to see people's designs because some people have such incredible designs. And there's always like, there are always so many smaller VTubers that like don't get noticed as easily because there really are just so many VTubers nowadays. But they have such lovely designs and like you click through and you're like, oh wait, you're, you seem really nice actually. And I've actually found some really nice people that way. Or like just browsing on the VTuber tag on Twitch sometimes, if I have free time and just like clicking a random, random stream that I like the look of. Like sometimes it doesn't pay off, but other times I found really nice streamers through that. It's very nice. It's one thing that I do like that I think Twitch has improved on. Uh, the, the, like Twitch still has a lot of problems. YouTube has a lot of problems. Everything has problems. But Twitch, when they added the ability to like add more categories and tag your own stream and stuff, I think that was such a good move. That was like an incredible move because being able to like add your own tags has helped so many smaller communities by just being like, yeah, we'll all add this tag, so we're all in the same category together, and people can find us easier. It's really nice. Let's stick the Millie back in. Oh, this one's not going in either. Ah! Ah! You can hear the squeak as I'm like levering it in. There we go. Okay, it's in. <laughs> and a Millie. Let's get the peelies off. 
Oh, it might be easier from the bottom, actually. Boop, boop, boop. Oh, I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. <laughs> Squeak! Yeah, we got the rat squeaks. Okay. Millie is free on one side. Because it's like, I, I need to remember I need to do both sides as well for each one. But Millie is so cute. Honestly, they all are. I love all of the characters in Two Faults so much. So much love in my heart for this whole cast. I just want the best for all of them. And we got a Millie! Boop, 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 boop. Millie! We got Millie! We got Capiche. We got a Haley. And we got Olive. I love them. I love them all so much. I love this game. I'm so glad I got these. My only problem now is like, I have so many standees. I've got a million standees. I don't have enough shelves to actually put them all on. I need to try and make space somehow to display them all. <laughs> right, oh, let's, let's peel the plastic off this too. While we're here. Let's have a little peeling off the plastic time. Because I got a Millie. She's so happy. She's so pouty. I love it. Also, hi, Gil. Look at all those fun standees. I've got so many. They're so nice. Welcome, welcome. Welcome to my grand merch showing off everything I have stream. I was wearing gloves, but I had to take them off because my hands were getting sticky and horrible. So now I've just got my hands out. Hi. Hello. And I'm peeling all the plastic off everything. Because <laughs> it's like, it's another part of buying merch as well. When I buy lots of standees, the thought of peeling all of the plastic off all in one go can sometimes be a bit intimidating. But it's nice doing it on stream because I can chat while I'm doing it. So I don't, so I'm not just like sat there in silence looking at this plastic like I got to peel this off. Oh, never thought of standees with a background. It's super cool. Isn't it so nice? I really like it. It's a really nice thing. It's another thing that like from the, the Studio Nekamata collaboration with Verpro. This is also like a, a multi-layered standee with a background and stuff and it's like there's a if I take this out there's a layer for the background like the little page and also the back of the computer as well shows up on the other side so once it's in like that slots into place you could see the the computer background on the screen but then if you look at it from the back it's the back of the computer it's so cute it's so lovely I love it so much but it's really, really nice. All the different layers to it. It's so cute. I love it so much. And my magnet. And the postcard. The signed postcard. <laughs> we all signed it. Right. I have so much plastic to peel off right now. I hope everyone likes this. <laughs> But uh, I'm doing well, thank you. I'm having a lot of fun. It's it's nice getting the chance to actually sort my merchandise out. Oh, I think I already peeled the plastic off this one. Yeah, I did. Never mind. Curio also already had the plastic taken off. These ones don't, though. Let's free the Mia. But, oh, DIY a like, tiered podium for the standees using tissue boxes and hot glue. <laughs> Wait, I, that's actually a great idea. Just like raising them up, having them on like a a tiered display. That's a really, really good shout, because then I'd only need one space one shelf, one space to put them, but I'd be able to have multiple stands there. It's actually really smart. I should do that. Anyway, here is the Mia! Mia is free. No more peelies. Let's let's free myself and my dinosaur nugget. Da -da -da -da. Whoop. Oh, that was a really easy one. That was really nice. Oh, and now you can see I have my fan on. Because look, if I put this here... My, my fan... <laughs> my fan's blowing them away. Woo! Whoop! <laughs> oh, oh, 
don't know where to go. I actually lost it. Oh, I found it. There we go. Yeah, no, it wasn't the fan. It was just me being really cool and telepathically sending it across my desk. <laughs> All right. We got me. We got Mia. Let's free the selfie. Hee <laughs> hee. Selfie freed. These ones are really nice to peel off. These ones are peeling so easily. I'm managing to find the edge easily. They're just going zoop. They're so nice. These are the most satisfying ones. They're so good. Also, Addy, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for joining. I hope you sleep well. Boom, boom, boom. Not even a glove heart this time. A heart heart with my, my, my hands. I keep saying to myself, my bare hands, and every time I say it, I want to make a silly joke, like, oh, bare hands, I thought you were a cat. Like, I'm making the joke for myself. But uh, my, I've been, like, I've been growing my nails out recently, and it's, it's, it's very slow progress, but I'm getting there. You can't even see very well. The lighting in my room at the moment kind of makes them look, like, yellowish. Because the, the white balance in my room is so off. It's like I make the light really yellow to counteract all of the blue from the camera and then it just makes everything too yellow. So I can't like, I can't win. <laughs> but it's okay. Let's free the Momo. Everyone shall be free soon. I'm getting all of these peeled off. Freedom for Momo Macaron. Boop, boop, boop. But I've got to say, I used to bite my nails all the time. Actually having nails makes this so much easier. Like the actual peelies part. Like it was impossible. Back when I bit my nails, it was impossible to peel these things off because I couldn't like get the edge up. But now I can. Now I have that freedom. I say. <laughs> I say as I can't find the edge of, of Geist. I don't know why I went straight for the ear, but I guess it works. Ba -ba -ba -ba. There we go. The Verpros are free. Oh yeah, look at that. I love it. All my keychains. Oh, this one too. Did I, did I get the plastic? I don't know if I got the peelies on this one. I did. I did. That one is already freed. <laughs> right. Is there anything else? Oh, my standees. How could I have forgotten this part? I got to get the peelies on these ones. How could I forget like the... The standees. Going like this. Oh, am I excited about footy tonight? I'm gonna be completely 100% honest. I did not know there was football happening tonight. <laughs> I had no idea. I'm not a sports person. I don't know anything about sports. I'm like, I always find out afterwards. Everyone will be like, oh, did you watch the Euro Cup? But I'm like, the, uh huh, that happened? I am i don't have a clue. <laughs> But yeah, as you can tell, I'm I'm really excited about it. I'm I'm thrilled. I can't wait. I I love I love a sports ball. <laughs> Hold on, I'm gonna try at the bottom. Try and peel from here. You believe me? I'm glad you do. I'm the number one sports ball fan. England. Oh, there we go. Oh, yes. Oh, look, it's me. It's me. Hold on, where's my focus? I lost my mouse. I did it again. I closed the program that I used to focus my camera. Why, why do I keep doing that? Anyway, look, it's me. It's me. 
It's so cute. Right, now let's peel the, the stand. The base of the stand. Like, you can see... Like, if I, like, position this in the light properly, you can see how scratched this is. This, is, this stand base is so scratched and scuffed. I'm so glad it... Oh, I dropped it. It's even more scratched and scuffed. <laughs> I'm so glad it has the protective plastic on it because it makes such a difference. Like, I go like that and it's fine. Is there a film? Yeah, they all have the film on it. I'm peeling all the films off and it's... It's like seeing all of the scuffs on the protective film really shows why there is one in the first place. Like, if this film was not here, the base itself would just have all these scratches. But as it is, I can peel it off. And look, it's just, it's fine. Not a mark. And that's why we have peelies. But yes, that means now I can... Oh. <gasps> it's me! It's me! And it slots into the base so nicely too. Oops, oops, oops. Jim. No, it's Leary. It's not Jim. Not a Jim standy. Yeah, this is the Leary one. But oh, it's so pretty. Like the the print quality is so lovely. I just let me look how gorgeous this is. It's so nice. It's so lovely. I'm so happy with how they turned out. It makes me, it makes me so glad. I'm like, I, I still kind of can't believe that not only do I have merchandise, but other people actually wanted to buy it as well. It still feels like, like a dream to me, but I love it so much. But it's so, I like, I, I really, I had high hopes that they would come out nicely. But they've come out nicer than I hoped they would. Like, it's just... The quality is so gorgeous. It's so... Hold on. Look how beautiful it is! Like, it shows up very blue on my camera. My, my webcam is just really blue in general. It doesn't look this blue in real life. It's definitely more teal. But you can see how beautiful it is. It's so gorgeous. And, like, it was going to be gorgeous anyway because it's Addy art. Because Addy drew it. Because she drew it. I knew it was going to be gorgeous. But I'm... I, 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 like, I can't stop gushing over it. I'm just feel like, oh, it's so pretty. It's so pretty. That's me? Doesn't seem real that it's me. It's like that... No, this is too cool to be me. I'm not that cool. <laughs> Get the... Get the film off here. And it's so funny too, because I'm still not even done with the box. There's still stuff in the box that I haven't gotten out yet. I've been showing off all this stuff. I have so much stuff and this isn't all of it yet. I still have more to show off. I still have to show off um, uh, Marigato. I got a bunch of her merch and that arrived pretty recently. And I am very, very excited to show that off because her merch is incredible. It is so good. It is the kind of merch I aspire for. But yes, we got the standees. They're so good. I stand them. Boop. Boop. They stand. So much. Oh, question is, did I get the secret Verpro Elan print? No, I haven't got the prints. Uh, I do want to get it at some point. I'm, I'm hoping I will be able to get it at some point. But with the amount of stuff that's been shipped out to me... I didn't end up getting any prints because with all of the stuff in the box and all the shipping and everything, they would probably get damaged. So I need to like arrange at some point in the future to like try and have like a big print bundle sent out to me in a way that can be done like in a flat envelope with like a cardboard backing so that it doesn't get damaged at all. But yeah, not yet, but I, I want it. I, I will figure out a way to get it. Because I'm in it. I have to have it, right? <laughs> oh, I just realized I took my gloves off. I can put my ring back on. This is my ring. 
Anyone was curious, I always wear this ring on my right middle finger. And it's gone to the point where if I don't have my ring on, I feel weird. My, my finger feels wrong. Like my hand feels like something's wrong if the ring's not there. But I can put that on now. Oh, uh, Liri Nendo when? I would love that. That would be amazing. Oh, actually, wait. Hold on. Do I still have it up? Oh, I can't find it. But uh, I actually have... I actually have a little standee that um, that Blake, uh, Ghost Aficionado, made for me. Uh, he actually made art of me as a Nendoroid and then made a little standee of it and sent it to me. It's not like official merch or anything. It's not like official art, but it was so cute. Wait, no, I, I probably just have the art. The art he made. He just like got an image of a nendoroid and like used the parts of it and then edited it to make it look like me as a nendoroid and it's so cute i have to have this somewhere yes i i do <laughs> the <laughs> the file name is liri nendo real.png <laughs> oh i wish it was real I wish it was real. Hold on, let me. Let me just get this up on the screen because I want to show this. But it's just it's just a really cute little thing. He he just like I was talking about how nice it would be to have an android of me. And then he worked so hard on this image and it, it looks so good. Here it is. Look at that. Look at that. Me, if I were a Nendoroid. Okay, I just resized it, but I accidentally resized it the wrong way and made it all pixely. But uh, pretend it's not pixely. The, the full size does not look like that. But isn't that great? Isn't that so great? I'm trying to remember what started it. Because I was talking about how nice it would be to have like a Leary figure. I would love to have like a, a tiny little figure of me. Like, you know, like the little gacha figures you can get. I'd love a Leary figure. And then we were thinking about like Frankenstein Nendoroid parts. And I think the hairstyle was like, is it Monster Hunter? I think it was Monster Hunter. Hold on. Hold on, my uh, my keyboard's all the way back here, so I kind of have to lean if I want to type anything. Uh. Uh. I can't reach my keyboard. My desk is too small. I need to get an on-screen keyboard for moments like this. Because I just can't reach my actual keyboard. But, uh, oh, Leary Gunpla model kit when? How cool would that be? How cool would that be? That would be incredibly cool. But, uh, speaking of Monster Hunter, you think I'd enjoy the Monster Hunter Stories remaster? I've, I've never actually played... I haven't played much Monster Hunter at all. Uh, I played a little bit of Monster Hunter World because friends were playing it. And that was the only reason. I only played it because I was playing it with friends. And I was never very good at it, but I had a lot of fun. <laughs> like, I was awful. It's not the kind of game I'm good at, but it was fun because I was playing it with friends. But, uh, yes, it was! It is this one! Hold on, let me save an image. It was one of the Monster Hunter Nendoroids. I was looking at it and I was like, this one has my hair. What if we just recolored it? What if we just got this Nendoroid and painted it? So that it was pink instead of white. <laughs> and then added cat ears. And then the next thing I know, he's made like a whole mock-up. <laughs> Using the Monster Hunter one as a bait. It's so great. It's so good. But I love it. But he actually made me a little standee of it. And I, I, 
I think it's over on my bookshelf at the moment, and it's behind things right now. So I'm I don't want to get up because my my room is a it's a disaster at the moment. I <laughs> I've made a big mess because I was trying to find those postcards earlier. So that's what I have to tidy tonight. But for now, I don't have to worry about it. For now, it is not my problem. That is a uh, future Liri's problem. Future Liri's going to hate me, but I don't care. Because I'm present Liri. <laughs> anyway, let's move these. Put them all. Put you over here. I've got so many. I love them. But yeah, oh, let me get the pin out as well. Let me show you the pin. The without a voice pin. It is so gorgeous. It is so lovely. Let me look at it. It's like if you look at it, it's got it's got like iridescent rainbow metal. And it is so pretty. It's so nice. But I love it, but I actually have two of these. I have two of the rainbow ones. <laughs> Wait, Sizzame, did you say you got two of the non-rainbow ones? Did you get like the, the plain metal ones for both of them? Because you said you got two? Oh, no, only one, okay. I don't know why I thought you had two. But uh, yeah, the, the peril of like the 50-50. But I was gonna say like, because if you did, oh, <laughs> Trade it. You know what? I would be willing. Would you like to? I will trade you. I'll trade you. <laughs> I'll trade you the regular metal for the rainbow metal. <laughs> Let's do it. I'll message you later. <laughs> How? We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. <laughs> but yeah, future Liri can't complain about present Liri because it'll be past Liri's fault at that point. Exactly. It's not even my fault. I'm free. I'm free from blame. It is the best. Right, anyway. <laughs> Link cable. Yeah, just power up your Game Boy. We'll figure it out. But uh, another thing I got as well is this gorgeous, gorgeous, please be happy art. And it's so funny because I looked at this and I was looking at it and I was like, I'm pretty sure... This is Deji's art. I'm pretty sure this is Deji's art. And I think I'm correct because Deji has such a, a unique, recognizable art style. And I've also commissioned a lot of art of her from her in the past of my OCs. So like I instantly recognize, I think it's like the eyes that does it. I always see the eyes and I'm like, I, I know who drew this. I'm pretty sure. It'd be very funny now if I'm completely wrong and it wasn't her. <laughs> but it's so pretty. It's so nice. Hold on, do I have something I could show as a comparison? Because... Let me see. I should have shown it off while Addy was here, because I'm sure she would have been able to tell me who did it. But I'm pretty sure it is. I think it was Ditchy, but she's done Leary fan art as well. It is! Oh, thank you for confirming! Thank you for confirming. Oops, you forgot to switch accounts. No, no, you, you, you're using the right account. This is um, this is where you where VN Studio Elon should be. Definitely, please look look at look at all the merch. Hey, has anyone heard of Studio Elan? The uh, one of my absolute favorite visual novel companies of all time. Full of Yuri visual novels with amazing stuff and all of like the, this this stuff. Uh, lots of. Lots of uh, stuff. Uh, he, he, he. Uh, ba, 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 ba. Can someone do exclamation point, Elan? <laughs> oh, thank you. You already did. <laughs> thank you. I was going to do it. And my, my keyboard's like right back here and I can't reach it. But hey, did you know you can get games, you can get merchandise, other things, and you can get a 10% discount with the code Liri in the web store. But it's so good. I've got so much lovely stuff. I... I'm so happy. Wait, hold on. I'm going to I'm going to find my other games out too because I I have physical copies of quite a few of the Studio Airline games. I think I know where they are. Hold on. I'll be right back. You may hear a lot of loud noises and crash bang wallop in the background. Don't worry about it. Everything's fine. There's no problems. 
and nothing to worry about, trust me. I'm trustworthy. But yes, hi. <laughs> Thank you for being here. Let me, let me go see. Liri in the distance screaming, by Studio Elanthus. <laughs> anyway. Studio Elan. Look at that. Look at this. Look at all of this. Look at all these games. Look at all these lovely things. So many lovely things. <laughs> oh, you don't have to thank me. I, this is the... It's kind of funny, I think I've already said this before as well. Uh, even if I wasn't a bellflower, even if I wasn't part of the ambassador program, I would still be here shouting to the rooftops, shouting from the rooftops. Not shouting to the rooftops, what am I on about? <laughs> shouting from the rooftops for everyone to hear about how much I love these games and this studio and all of the people involved. Like, it's not just that the games are great, but everyone behind the games is also so great. It's it's just so lovely. Everything is lovely. And I love it. But uh, look, I've got the, the Plappy Bappy Happy official art book. And this is so pretty. This is such a big art book. Look how many pages this has. This is, I think this is the chunkiest art book I have for a, for a game that I own. It's so nice and it's so pretty. Like just, you just open it at any page and you're just like, that's gorgeous. Oh wait, there's a postcard. <laughs> postcard, look at that. I love them. I love them. And then I have physical copy, Highway Blossoms Gold Rush Edition. I have the physical copy. It's so nice. Oh, hold on, I gotta, I gotta. There we go. Oh, it, it, it spins as I close the case. I got Highway Blossoms and I've got Heart of the Woods, physical edition. Da -da -da -da. And yeah, now that, now that Addy's pointed this out to me as well, I can't help but notice. It's like, it's so nice how there's like the spine with the art design on it. And then the reversible cover has like the spine just in plain white as well. So it can all be, you can have everything matching however you want. I really love that. Is it the same with Highway Blossoms? I think it is. It is, yeah. This has also got the, the plain spine on this cover and then the, the art spine on the other one. I really love that. And then of course, of course I have Please Be Happy because it's so nice. And then we've got the, the side art there. And then this one has the plain white. Oh, I really love this art as well though. Oh, see, I like having the spines with the, the images on because when I have these all on my shelf, it feels so nice seeing all of the designs, like seeing the, the color for the designs. I really like having them this way because it makes the shelf look more interesting to me. Like, I feel like it would be really nice to have them all matching and have like the plain one with just the logo. But for me, I like my shelves to be bright. I like to like show off everything. I like it to be like you look over and then it catches your eye and you look again, as opposed to just being all like neat and uniform. But yeah, I've, I've got four so far and I'm hoping to get more as well. I definitely want to get more. I just, um. I've been saying to myself though, I, I need to I need to arrange things a bit better before I can like buy more stuff. Also, we're Puppy Creations. Hello! Welcome on in! Welcome in Raiders! How's it going? 
To anyone who's new here, hello. I'm Liri, I'm a pink haired cat girl from the UK. I love comfy games and puzzle games. And at the moment I am, I am being the, the biggest advocate for Studio Elan that there is in the world at this very moment in time. There's probably other people who shill just as hard as me, but, uh, but I love it so much. But welcome in. Oh, I've been checking out the Power Wash Sim DLC. Oh, is it any good? I hope you've been having fun with it. I I haven't played Power Wash in a while. I used to play loads of Power Wash, but I've, I think I got distracted by House Flipper and ended up not playing it for a while. I have to check it out. I haven't checked out like any of the DLC, but I hope you had a good stream. Thank you for bringing the raid this way. And uh, if you have to get any rest or anything or food or drink after your stream, Please don't feel like you have to stick around, but if you do want to, um, check out... Uh, oh, my, my desk is such a mess. There's so much stuff here right now. <laughs> but yeah, oh, there's a Back to the Future pack. Wait, I have to check that out. <laughs> I had no idea. I know as well that Escape Simulator also has a bunch of DLC that I haven't checked yet. And I... I need to check that out at some point too because I love Escape Sim. But there's so many games and so little time. Uh, you like House Flipper but don't like the freedom of choice in it. Oh, see, that's why when I play House Flipper, I really like that there are jobs you can do. You can get jobs and missions. And I feel like I do so much better when I have like a set goal that I have to do versus just having the entire house and being like, what, what do I do here? <laughs> but it helps to like do it on stream i think because then there's a little less like decision power decision paralysis because if i don't know what to do i can just be like what should i do here and there are suggestions so i don't have to think of it myself <laughs> but yeah i i really enjoyed house flipper i enjoyed the dlc for house flipper one way more than the base game like the the pets dlc and the farm dlc and the luxury one those three dlcs were really really good and i had a lot of fun with those and they added so many nice things too but uh, now i've moved on to house flipper 2 and <laughs> i'm done with all the jobs in that and i i want more now i want dlc for house flipper 2 now because <laughs> they added so many nice quality of life things it's a lot of fun but yes, at the moment though, I'm just, I'm doing a little stream to go through everything I've bought in the past six to 12 months and show it all off because I keep meaning to show it off and then I just don't. <laughs> so now I'm doing it, I'm just getting everything out. I have so many things. But at the moment I'm going through everything I've bought from the Studio Elan web store. I really need to set up like a, a button to do the Studio Elan command. Because I can't reach my keyboard at the moment. Wait, I can just copy paste Suzume's message from earlier. There we go. Oh wait. Da. There we go. I'm currently going through all of my merchandise for Studio Elan. If anyone doesn't know who they are, they make Yuri visual novels and they have made s some incredible, incredible games. And it's like, it's not just Studio Elan themselves as well. Uh, they also have a, a publishing branch called uh, Bell House. Sorry, my brain went blank for a second then. Uh, they, they have like a publishing branch of Bell House, which is for like, smaller studios to be published through them as well and those games are also incredible i'm actually playing one at the moment every tuesday at the moment when i stream i'm playing this game twofold we're having twofold tuesdays <laughs> and it's this game has it has moved my my heart so much like it is so such an emotional game with such well-made characters, well-crafted stories, emotional experiences. It's so good. It's really, really good. But yeah, I'm, I'm just here like I, I may be an ambassador. I'm a stream ambassador for Studio LM now, but um, I would be doing this even if I wasn't. I'm, I'm just like a, a, a staunch advocate for this studio. I love them so much. 
Oh my goodness, another raid. Wait, a perfect. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Blah, 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 blah. Ha ha ha. Hello. Hi, Mari. Thank you for the raid. Welcome in. Welcome in, raiders. Oh, also a blue lobster as well. Thank you for the follow. Thank you for deciding to stick around. Welcome on in. But uh, welcome, raiders. I see you were playing Highway Blossoms. I see. <laughs> Welcome on in, Raiders! To anyone who's new here, hello! I'm Liri, I'm a pink-haired cat girl from the UK, and I love comfy games and puzzle games. And at the moment, I am shilling Studio Elan as much as I can. Which I know you also do, Mari, so... <laughs> oh, thank you for the follow as well, Zaturners. And thank you for the lurk, too! I hope you have a good rest after your stream, we're puffy. You were blossoming at the highway. I am so glad. I love highway blossoms. I think highway blossoms might have been... I don't know if it would have been the first, because I played some really bad visual novels back in the day, but I think it was one of the first Yuri visual novels I ever found. Because I remember finding it and buying it on Steam and being like, wait, les lesbians? Lesbians? Wait, there are games like this that aren't straight? And oh goodness, we know where that went. <laughs> and I've just, I've just fallen further and further and further into the, the Studio Elan rabbit hole. And I don't want to climb out. I'm happy in here. This is like the comfiest rabbit hole to be in. There's a little bit of like cellophane on the edge of this and I can't get it off. Oh, I got it, I got it. Ha ha. You can't even see it, it's the tiniest bit. Tiny, tiny bit of cellophane, there we go. But yeah, it was, when did I play it? Hold on, I can check. If I check my Steam, I can check out when I played it. Cause I can see when I got the achievements. Where... No, I played it before achievements were added, I think. Maybe, I don't know, hold on. I never realized how hard it is to use my computer without my keyboard. My keyboard is like back here, behind my monitor, behind all this stuff. And I can't type. <laughs> I need to get an on-screen keyboard. All right, anyway, before I look that up, I just want to say thank you for raiding me as well, Mary. And I know it is super late for you. So if you have to head off, if you have to go and get some sleep, please don't feel like you have to stick around. But uh, I'm glad, I'm glad you got to raid me. I'm glad you got to raid me right as I was going through all of the, the Elan merch. It's so perfectly timed. <laughs> but yes, for anyone else here as well, um, as I mentioned, I am a Studio Elan Bellflower. I'm one of the stream ambassadors, but uh, Mari is also one of the Bellflowers as well. We are, we are both flowers. We are both here to, to rep the Yuri times. <laughs> But yeah, thank you. Thank you for sending the raid this way. But yes, I'm I'm currently playing Twofold. Twofold is my my stream for Tuesdays at the moment. And I've I've just finished Millie's route and I've just started Caprice's. I'm like I would estimate that I'm near the end of Act 1. But I haven't gotten super far yet. But it's been so interesting playing Caprice's route after knowing everything that happens in Millie's. Like, seeing the other side of this story is so interesting, it's so good. But I'm, I'm having such a blast because I'm, I'm just really... I'm, I'm so enamored with the art club. I love them so much. I love them so much. Yes, also you see my Millie- yes, hold on, wait, yeah. There she is. There she is, isn't she beautiful? I also have- hold on, where is she? Where's she gone? There she is. There she is. Ha ha! <laughs> Look at my Millie's. Wait, yeah, it's her birthday too. Happy birthday, Millie. It's Millie's birthday. Because it's the, the 10th, July 10th. Happy Baffy, Millie. Happy Baffy. Clappy Baffy, happy, Millie. <laughs> Everyone say happy birthday, Millie. Let's support her. 
Why is auto mod holding that? Why did auto mod hold the word lesbian? I've added that as a permitted term already. Why is it doing that? It's okay. It's added now, either way. Happy birthday, Millie. <laughs> but yeah, I've just been going through my, my studio Elan stuff. Oh, it might be. It might be like capitals and lowercase. You know what I need to do? I need to go through at some point in my own chat and just like add everything to the whitelist. Like every single possible like word gay um thingy what's the word i'm thinking of the word for something that's like similar but not the same uh but not a simile every oh. every alternative every alternative why did that take me so long <laughs> every possible alternative of the word gay and how it can be changed in any way anything like that <laughs> i just need to go through and add them all because uh, I do have auto mod quite high because I'd always rather that auto mod hold something and I can let it through and we laugh at it than risk something awful coming through. So that's like the main reason why I have it up high. But it's it's so funny when it's like there's there's no way people have like not said the word lesbian in my chat. <laughs> it's so wild. Yeah, nobody was right, but synonym is another good word for it too. It's just not the one I was thinking of. <laughs> but yes, and that's not all my stuff too. I also have... Oh wait, this is the same leaflet. Hold on. <laughs> I already showed this leaflet. Where is it? Somewhere. Oh, but as well, before I move on as well, I want to show off my sticker book really quickly. Because this is my sticker book. This is part of my anniversary merchandise. And I've got some... I got some stickies. I got some stickers in here. See, this notebook is special because this is not just a normal notebook. This is a notebook with sticker backing paper. So what you do is, if you have stickers, you can peel them out. You can put them back in. You can peel them out again. So if you place stickers and you are like me and you don't want to commit to putting them somewhere because that's really permanent, stick a book, stick a book, stick a book. With me, my stickies. <laughs> Wait, you want that? Oh yeah, unfortunately this was the, this was my anniversary merchandise bundle. This was from the start of February when I celebrated my three year stream anniversary. But I would like to do reruns in the future because they're so nice. They're just really, really nice. And I think, I think like, honestly, I'd, I'm trying to think how to word what I'm trying to say. Uh, what I would do is like, I really want to do a rerun of the merchandise, maybe for my fourth anniversary as well. But I'm at the point where I'm like, even if nobody else wanted to buy them, I would be willing to just buy them all myself. I would like just put in all of the money to buy a bunch to keep in stock. Because they're so lovely. Every part of them has come out so lovely. Like this is the the sticker book, the front and back. It's like fully full design printed on front and back. All of the sticker pages. The sticker sheet itself. Hold on, I've, I've got like a full sticker sheet somewhere. Let me find one. We got one. Here, this is the sticker sheet. <laughs> sheet of Leary stickers. Look how cute they are. These these were all done by my emote artist, Ghost Aficionado my lovely lovely friend of many many years and him and Addy were the artists for the whole set so uh, Ghost Aficionado did the notebook and the stickers and then Addy did the the standees oh which are, which are standing up and Addy did the art for these standees which are so beautiful they're so lovely and also signed postcards <laughs> where 
for, for people who ordered the bundle in the pre-order, I signed all of the postcards. So, like, if you put your name in, in the notes when you made the order, I would, like, sign the postcard for you. This, this is my brother's. This is the one I signed for my brother. <laughs> but, yeah, I had so much fun signing those and just adding, like, little hearts and flowers and stuff. It was like, I think, like, Suzume for your postcard... When I thought of you, I instantly thought of, like, the flower crown you wear, so I did, like, a little row of flowers as the signature for yours. <laughs> I tried to add, like, a little bit to each of them. I, like, a little, draw a little cat face, draw some hearts, add some little details. It was a lot of fun. But, yeah, you get to see my signature, too. And it's like, I, I actually hand-signed them all as well. It's like, it would have been so much easier for me if I'd just copied and pasted my signature, but I didn't. Every single one is unique. Like I, I did each one individually that <laughs> because I'm a fool and I like to make more work for myself, but I feel like it makes them more personal that way. But yeah, Addy did the art for that and the art for the standees. And then Ghost Aficionado who does all my emotes did the sticker book and the stickers. And so it was really nice having both of my main artists being a part of the bundle together. It was it was really nice. Made me very happy. Also, Jack, hello, welcome, welcome. Sorry you're a little late. Oh, don't worry about it. Never have to apologize for being late. It, if you make it here, that's all you need. <laughs> but hello, I got my hands out today. Got hands. Hearts for everybody. But yeah, I, I did loads of flowers for yours because I thought of the flower crown and I thought it would be cute. <laughs> and yeah, I, I did the like the the great axe for Barb as well and the mod sword. <laughs> but yeah, I got my hands out. I took off the gloves as well. I, I did have gloves on earlier, but my hands were getting really stifled in the gloves, so I just took them off. I'm just like, you, you just get my hands today. You get to see just how pale I am. <laughs> So you can really tell how pale I am because you can see my blue veins. <laughs> but, uh, gonna knock out now since it's late. That is completely fine. Thank you for stopping in though. But yeah, I'm hoping to do more sticker books in the future. One day. Much to think about before then, but it this won't be the end. I refuse to let it be the end because they're too nice. They're too nice. I don't want it to be just like a one and done thing. <laughs> But I hope you rest well. Reject Daystar, become VTuber. Daystar? Am I missing something? I don't know. I, I don't have a brain today. I'm just showing off material goods. The, the brain is gone today. But uh, I had a hilarious moment earlier where I've been spending so long this morning and afternoon I trying to think. find my signed postcard. It's true, I cannot think. I was trying to find this postcard and also the postcard for my, uh, for the Verpro Eats. I knew I'd put the two of them together somewhere, but I couldn't find them. I was turning my room upside down, trying to find these two, these two postcards. I couldn't find them anywhere. I was, I was genuinely getting upset because I was like, well, I don't want to, I don't want to lose my Verpro Eats. Like, it's so important. <laughs> but uh, I opened up my sticker book at the start of the stream. And what do you know? Both of them were just tucked away, just right behind the inside cover, just right here. They were, they were just in the book. I'd put them in there to keep them safe, clearly. And then I forgot I did it, because I'm smart! Ah, oh, this is a fun way of saying the sun. Oh! Because it's the only star visible during the day. Wait, that makes sense. No, that makes a lot of sense. I'm just silly. <laughs> but yeah, I, I reject the sun. The sun is mean to me. <laughs> also, Dr. Anime, hello! Welcome, welcome! Welcome on in. <laughs> you doubled over in silent laughter when I opened the sticker book revealing the cards. I... I could not stop laughing either. I was, I was like torn between laughing and crying. The second I opened it and realized they were in there. 
Like, I'm really glad they were. I was so glad I haven't lost them, because I had no idea where else they could feasibly be. But, uh, yeah, I, I didn't expect it. I did not expect <laughs> Also, CJ, hello, good morning. Welcome, welcome. Welcome on in, everybody. How's it going? Welcome to, oh my goodness, there's just so much stuff here right now. I just have a table full of stuff. I'm just gonna put my, my signed Dotavu postcards right here. I got them both signed. It's so funny knowing that Dotavu voiced both of these characters and they are so different. <laughs> They're so very different. It's so great. But I love them. I cherish. I cherish. There's also a Charlie on the back there. So pretty. And I know this is Addy art. <laughs> So nice. Right, what else do I have? I have some more Studio Elan stuff as well that I, I found out. What else have I got? Oh, I got my stickers. I got stickers. Stickers, Muto art. I've got Muto stickers. And um, fun fact about these stickers, uh, when I got these, um, I bought two sheets of each of them because I knew I wanted to stick them on my PC. So I've got a bunch of these stickers on my PC case right now, but I also have these ones. And you know what that means? You know what that means in a little bit? A thing to do once I've gone through all of this? Yeah, I'm gonna be sticking all of my stickers in here right now. <laughs> uh, will this game get a Switch port? Which one? Uh, please be happy. Because I, I think they're trying to get a Switch port sorted for Please Be Happy. But uh, I actually have a Switch copy of Heart of the Woods. <laughs> the Heart of the Woods Switch port. This was done, um, this was limited run games. And I, I really love this. I love that I have this. I, I, this is something I meant to show off for like half a year and I still haven't. <laughs> But it's so nice. Oh no, the one I was playing yesterday, I don't know. I don't know how difficult it would be, but I would love if they could. Like if if there was a twofold switch port, I would I would be extremely happy about that. But uh, I died I don't know anything about like what goes on behind the scenes. I'm not involved in like any of the development kind of things. <laughs> I'm just here as a fan. I just see the game's release, I play them. I talk about how much I love them. But yeah, I know I know plans are in the works for getting Please Be Happy on Switch, which I'm really excited for because I I have such a soft spot for it. Like Please Be Happy was what really I feel like a lot of people discovered me through Please Be Happy. And it's really special to me as well because of Addy being the director too and Addy also being one of my closest friends and also the artist for my VTuber model. <laughs> it's like, it's very close to my heart. There's a, there's a lot there that's like, this this one I feel very strongly about. This one I feel very passionately about. And it's really nice. But yeah, it's so exciting just seeing, seeing Studio Elan grow as well. Like from the small studio, just doing more, releasing more games, more stuff. It's, it's so nice. Also, I have these. Speaking of please be happy. I got these. Got the book bookmarks. An Aspen and a Juliet. Because please be happy is one of those games where I can't decide which route I like first. I like them both in different ways. I, I can't decide what I would want like my, my canon route to be in please be happy. I love them both. I can't choose, and that's why I simply refuse to choose. I, I just won't choose. And then I also have this postcard, which is so nice. <laughs> look at this though, look. Oh, I forgot I'm manually focusing. I'm so silly. Look at that, that's 2021. <laughs> I've been here a while. <laughs> I've been here a while. Oh, I was going to look up when I played Highway Blossoms. Hold on. Because I think it wasn't super long after it was released on Steam that I ended up uh, playing it and getting the achievements. 
yeah, let me check. Uh, th the achievements... The first achievement I got in Highway Blossoms was 2017. Which is seven years ago. How was that seven years ago? How... not... How... How was 2017 seven years ago? That's... no. That just sounds wrong. That just does not sound correct. What? I'm... I, I refuse to believe in time. I'm, I'm choosing to not acknowledge the passage of time. Thank you all for understanding. Anyway... <laughs> anyway, I also have... Yes. I have this Studio Elan mixtape. Volume 1. It has got songs. Oh, I knocked over Olive. I'm sorry, Olive. And then let me... Got some really good songs. Honestly, all of the music, all of the musicians involved in the Studio Elan games as well, they always just knock it out of the park. Everything fits so well. Everything just like is so perfectly well made, so perfectly crafted. It's so good. Oh, the Stanley Parable came out 11 years ago. No. No. No, it doesn't seem real. Oh, that sleeve scares you because the disc can just fall out. Yeah, I'm always so careful whenever I pick it up because it's like... Whoop. There it goes. I, I'm always like holding it up this way. And then I also have... Because of course I do. I have my Addy art books. <laughs> My Addy Rosa art books. And I love them. I love Addy's art so much. Look at this. Look, look, more Highway Blossoms as well. It's so gorgeous. It's so pretty. Her art is so good. I love her art. It's so lovely. Got Heart of the Woods. Got Please Be Happy. Oh, we got a b -b 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 lock and key. So pretty. We got summer. Summer uni. It's so nice. And Heart of the Woods again. It's so pretty. It's so nice. It's so interesting as well, seeing all of this, like the art from 2020. This is the 2020 art book. And if you compare it to Addy's art now, it's like this was already gorgeous at this point. But then you see like the stuff she's making recently as well. And you can see how she just continues to grow. Her art is just so, it's so good. I'm just here feeling just so proud of the fact that she agreed to do my VTuber model for me. <laughs> like the fact that I, I managed to convince her to do it. It's like she, she'd never had experience with it. She was like, I don't know how to draw for live 2D, but I'm willing to give it a try if you don't mind it being scuffed. And I was like, well, we will learn together and it'll be great. And I'm pretty sure after doing my model, she then said, not doing that again. <laughs> but she still agrees to keep being my artist too. And I'm I'm so thankful, I'm so grateful for it. Uh, anyway, um, I. I have two copies of each of them because I love her and want to support her. <laughs> but I love these art books so much. They're so nice. I've got so many things. And uh, another thing I have as well that I, I can't really show off on stream because it is on my wall and also massive. But uh, I have the, the wall tapestry for Please Be Happy as well. And that is on my wall, like directly to my right. Like, if I look to my right, I can see it. Like, it just fills the whole wall. And it's so nice. It's so good. Oh, wait, I know what else I have, too. Hold on, I just need to... It's stuck on the side of my wardrobe at the moment, so I have to just take it off, but... I also have this, look! The, the 2020 postcard. Smile! It's so cute! 
It's so cute. This is stuck on, on the side of my wardrobe at the moment. It's like right next to my desk. So I can just take it off and stick it back up. But yeah, I, I have that on display there. It's so cute. It's all just so lovely. It's like I, I always feel so justified in spending all of my money on Studio Elam because there has not been a single time when I felt like I haven't gotten my money's worth. Usually I feel like I get more than my money's worth. It is so nice. It's all just, you can tell how much love and passion goes into it. Like this isn't just like a, a soulless churning out whatever kind of situation. You can really tell like how much, how much love and work and effort goes into anything. Like nobody puts in less than 100% effort like it's so it's just so special it's just it just really feels special to me and I love it but yeah I, I have a lot of stuff here <laughs> and this isn't even all of it wait let's get my my Addy art from earlier out too this one was just a little gift she just drew this for me she just drew it. We we were exchanging K-pop photo cards and she was like, you know what? I will also draw you. This is so cute. <laughs> right, what else do I have? Okay, there's only one more major thing to show off now, but it's not Studio L related. But I do have that too, the little postcard. Hey. Share online and tag us. I, I'm doing a whole video. I hope that's okay. <laughs> I love it all so much. Also, Cassandra, hello. Look at all the Liri. Look, there's so much Liri right now. I'm I'm showing off my, my anniversary merch. I love it. I love it so much. Look at the stands. Look at the stands. Look at the stickers. Look at my sticker book. The sticker book is the part that I am the, the most excited about. I love that I have this. I love having the sticker book because it's so nice because you just have the paper like this, but it's sticker paper so you can peel off stickers and then stick them back in. You don't have to commit to being like, well, I've stuck this down so it's stuck there now. If you change your mind, you can move it somewhere else. It's so good. It's so great. And the stickers turned out so beautifully as well. Like. Hold on, let me let me bring these up to the camera and show it all. Focus. Look, I'm blo I'm blocking my own tracking at the moment. Uh, I'm I'm just gonna like head empty for a second. Head empty. But look at the. That's so good. I'm I I just knocked Olive over again. I'm I'm a menace, but in the corner too. Popcat. <laughs> the reason I did like multiple copies of the, the Popcat stickers was so I could make a little flip book at the corner. That's the whole reason I did it. But I love them so much. They turned out so nicely. I'm so sorry, Olive. I'm so sorry, Olive. I'm so sorry, Caprice. I'm a menace. I've got too much stuff on my desk. I really should start moving stuff. Anyway, boop. But they turned out so well, I love them. And also the Verpro Eats skirt keychains as well. I I got my little dinosaur nugget. It's so cute, it's so perfect. I love it so much. It's so good. And this accursed postcard that I was searching for for hours this morning, and then it was just tucked inside my sticker book. I'm glad I found it, <laughs> but it's so good. I love it so much. I love that this is all like, you can just imagine like everyone else's food is like, thank you for throwing something at me. It's all stuff that you would like go out and order. Like you go to a cafe or go to like a, a food stand outside and order it, get the, like the crepe, the donut, the macaron, the takoyaki. And then I'm just storming into the place with dinosaur nuggets, like sup. <laughs> Have you all ordered your food? Great, I've got dino nuggies. <laughs> I think it sums me up quite well. It's how I would be though. I feel like if 
I'm, I'm the kind of awful person who goes to a restaurant and then orders like the plainest thing on the menu. <laughs> but I love it. It's just that the art is so cute. It turned out so well. I need to put it on my keys, actually. Oh. I might need to buy another one of them because I want to put them all on display with each other, but I also want one on my keys. I may have to order myself another keychain. But yes, I've I've been through quite a lot of stuff so far. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna move the standees away. I'm gonna find somewhere to put all of these stands because they are so, they're so lovely, but they're also huge. And I keep knocking Olive over and I feel sorry for them. So <laughs> I'm just gonna put them. <clears throat> Please be happy, Standy. From the the anniversary set, it's so pretty. And without a voice, Standy from the Kickstarter, which is also so pretty. And Millie. And my actually, I can stay. I'm gonna keep mine. You can only see my feet, but I'm, I'm keeping mine up on my desk. Oh, and my magnet. Magnet and Nekomata. Standy. I love this. I think this, this came out so cutely. It's so sweet. But you can also go over here. What else? Out of the way. I need desk space back. All right, let me try and stack this up as best as I can. Go like this. Got postcards. Stickers you stay, I'm gonna stick those in the book. That can go here. That can go here. Oh. This is all of the without a voice stuff. That can go here. Twofold art book can go here. Let's put that on the desk. to the side. Ba, 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 ba. I've, got so, I've, I've gotten so much stuff out. <laughs> right, the physical games. I'm going to put these away. Okay. Oh, Gigi, going to have dinner and prepare. Oh, I hope you have a lovely dinner. I hope the preparation goes well. But thank you for stopping in. Thank you for being here. I'm glad you got to see all of my stuff. I have so much gorgeous, gorgeous stuff. Everything is so lovely. It's so nice. So many nice things. There's cat fur again. Just cat fur everywhere. Ha. Ha. And then keychains. Let me collect these. Oh, and the pin. Boop, boop, boop. Thank you for the head pats too. But yeah, all of the art is so gorgeous. It's so nice. It's part of why I wanted to show it all off so much. Like every part of this has just been so lovely. I got so many nice things. I wanna, I wanna show them all off. All right, so let's, get this lovely stack. Let's make another stack on the floor like I always do. <laughs> so now I've just got the pins, my two standees, and stickers, which I can stick in my sticker book. Because <laughs> now I have the sticker book to do it. It's so nice. It's so nice. Right, let's start with these. How am I going to arrange these? The answer is I'm gonna just... I'm just gonna blap them on the... <laughs> blap them on the page and see how it looks. That is my whole strategy. My strategy here is 
how am I going to organize these? Who knows? Oh, I know what I want to do, actually. Let's have this over here. Morgan is looking out of the window. At Tara in a construction hut. <laughs> And then these two can go down here. I'll save these stickers for now. The, these, are, these will do for now, for here. I'm gonna do just one of each character to begin with for the page. <laughs> and then well, we have to have Amber with the, the gold, the treasure. Obviously. <laughs> oh, I know how I want to arrange this. Yes. So what I do is I'm going to have Marina there. And then I'll use this like... Like that. Yes. Haha. <laughs> See, this is why I like the sticker paper. I can just peel it off and replace it again. It's perfect. Ba, ba, ba. And I think... Yeah, I'll just put her at a slight angle. Yeah, look at that! Oh, the hold music on, on your call sounds like my going live music. Oh, I love that. Wait, what if I put that on as background music right now? Oh, actually. I'm gonna put this one back on because I, I meant to like loop this one for a little bit and then when I changed the track, it's it didn't loop. And it went into the the Death and Taxes Grimm's Fantango and I just kind of like that song and left it on. <laughs> we'll do this. Oh, Marina and Millie sharing a VA is very funny. <laughs> I love it. I love, I love like when there's like the, the repeat voice talent and it's like, oh wait, you do this character and this character? Wow. Okay, I'm not going to fit all of the plappy bappy happies on here. So you get the next page. So we're going to have Mimo with jacket. Mimo with jacket goes here. And then one side has an Aspen. One side has a Juliet. And V can go here. <laughs> I love the little <laughs> the little onesie for this sticker too. It's so cute. <laughs> I'm gonna move Miho up a bit. There we go. That'll do for now. The start of the sticker book. I've started putting stickers in it. I'm so glad. <laughs> oh wait, so so in a long long about way, Haley, Caprice, and Millie are all sisters. In an alternate universe, yeah. Interesting to think about. Also, Lanza, when hello, welcome, welcome. Welcome to hand cam time. I've got my sticker book. I'm putting stickers in my sticker book. That is the current topic of the stream. I'm just putting stickers in here. Look at my stickers. <laughs> I got so many. Got so many nice stickers. And the next thing I want to show off as well also involves stickers. But this is not Studio Elan related now. This is... Sorry, there's an emergency. I've lost the boy. Oh, no, I, oh, I, found him. I found him. Crisis averted. The next thing I want to show off is some merchandise from my lovely good friend, Marigato. <laughs> 
She released a bunch of merch recently, and I was instantly just like, well, I need this, please. Yes, please. I want the merch, please. And part of that merch is... Here comes the boy. <laughs> Look at this. Look how cute this is. Look how adorable this is. Look at the little beans. Look at his little tail. Look at his little face. It's so cute. He's so cute. I got the boy. <laughs> this is so lovely. You would not believe how soft this is. This plushie is so soft. I'm just, I, I love just being like, squish, 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 squish. Give it a stroke. It's so soft, so, it's like the soft belly. It's, I, I could just sit here and go like this for ages. It's so, like velvety smooth in a way where you're just like, it's so cute. It's so cute. But yeah, I, I, was, I was messaging her and I was like, oh yeah, I see, I see you have got stickers too. Please may I order multiple sticker sheets? So I, I ordered uh, multiple sticker sheets, but look, look at her stickers. <laughs> They're so good. So we need to get one of these. We've got to stick these in the sticker book as well. But then there is also this key ring that says forced to work, born to nap. And this is such a mood. This is a great mood. I love it a lot. I need to also put that on my keys. I need to add everything to my keys. I'm, I'm gonna have like more keychain than key. And I'm fine with that. Okay, then what else have I got? I've got her card. I've got a little business card. And she signed it for me too. I've got him signed. Look, it's a little maid outfit. Maid card Mari. I love it. Because it's really nice because uh, Mari's recently become part of uh, Mofua Cafe, who I I am already friends with a few of the members of Mofua Cafe. So when Mari joined, I was just like, oh yeah, that, that makes so much sense. It makes perfect sense. She fits in so well. And it's really nice. It's really nice how much like matching stuff there is. What else have I got? Oh yeah, I got, uh, I got my first my first ribbon my first like convention ribbon the first one i own the body is round and the body is round and so what i did was i stuck it on my off kai expo badge for last year <laughs> when verpro were guests at off kai last year i stuck it on there <laughs> so i have that i want to get more i want to get more more ribbons I want to have like a whole like scarf of ribbons like I saw some people having. And then, was that it? No, that's not it. Yeah, no, that's not it. There's also Mari's banana. And there's also this adorable pin. Like, look, look how cute this pin is. Look, it's so pretty. It's so pretty and shiny. And I closed the focus program again. Why do I do this? Why do I keep instinctively closing this program? Every time I'm focusing my camera and then I, I close the program. I don't know why. But anyway, look, look how cute this is. It's so shiny and nice. It's such a lovely pin. I love it so much. But yeah, I got a, a lovely, lovely lot of stuff from Mari and a postcard. He <laughs> signed for me. I love it. I, th there was something else too. Because I asked her. Hold on. I had another card as well, and I've dropped it. <laughs> I had one of the one of the trading cards from Off Guy Expo. I I asked her if she could get hold of a a Rita Kamishiro one for me because um, I'm, I'm a big fan of Rita and also one of my very close friends has been doing a lot of music stuff with Rita recently as well. So I asked for the card if I could be cheeky and get it and she got it for me and I dropped it and I don't know where I put it. I 
found it. I found it. I got a Rita card. <laughs> so yes, thank you, Mari, for that as well. Thank you for, thank you for hooking me up. Hee <laughs> hee. But yeah, it's so nice. Oh, I still need to figure out what your Gen 4 ribbon will be, but yeah, th there's loads of time for that. But I'm hoping that I can get to Off Guy Expo next year. That's my aim. I want to be there in person. Like, I had my, my tiny little iPad tour this year, but it wasn't enough. Like, as soon as I got out there, I was being told that the time was up. It wasn't enough. I want to be there. <laughs> so next year, I'm hoping. Fingers crossed. Also, Nugs, hello! Yes, I've, I've got my, my bare hands today. Not my cat hands. <laughs> but yeah, I did have gloves on earlier, but it got to the point where, like, I was I was peeling, like, the, the peely plastic off of my standees. <laughs> And I couldn't get it up with the gloves on, so I was like, I'm just gonna take them off. And I didn't realize how stuffy my hands had gotten inside the gloves too. Like my hands got so sweaty, I had to like get my wipes and wipe them off. So yeah, it's just hands. Hello, my hands. Yeah, can't believe I was a bear all along. I, that is my secret. I may be a cat girl, but I have bear hands. Oh. Oh, you'll bring some of the ribbons from this year too. Oh, I would love that. I would love that. I want to get loads of ribbons. I want to get them and like stack them all up. I'd also love to make a Sandra ribbon too, like a little worm on a string one for next year. <laughs> but yes, I've got so many nice things and I love it all so much. It's so lovely. I think it's so, it's so good. <laughs> Wait, I bet I have my, my card from last year of Mari as well, because I, I got her card last year as well. Hold on. My card! <laughs> I found mine! My card from Off Kai Expo last year! And I got that signed by Rat and Mari as well. <laughs> I asked them to sign it for me. But yeah, that's my that's my card from last year, and also the Sam Joel card as well. But I can't find my Mari. I had a Mari card as well. I don't know where I put it. I didn't put it with these ones, apparently. But yeah, these, these are from 2023 off Kai. These are from 2024 off Kai. <laughs> but yes, yeah, so I've got so many nice things though. Let's put them away safely. Let's put them back. Make sure everything is safe. Back in the box you go. Except the stickers. We need to put the stickers in the book. Haha. -ha. Yeah. Oh, got a bunch of pins from Dokomi this year. If it goes on, you might need a bigger bag. Oh, maybe, yeah. I still don't know what I'm doing with all my pins. I really like having pins. I really like buying them, but I don't really, like, have anywhere to put them or display them. So I don't know why I keep getting them. Anyway, this could be the Mari page now. Boop. A solid start. The body is round. <laughs> you seem like you should be in the corner. That's a corner face if I ever saw it looking up. <laughs> I love these stickers, they're so silly. I love them. Oh, you know the ring of cloth that scouts use to pin badges? Oh yeah, like like a sash. Make a sash for them. That's a really good idea. I know a lot of people who end up getting like, they get like a big, like, you know, like a shield shape. They get like a fabric shield shape that they like put up on the wall. And then you put all the pins onto that, like onto the fabric. And I think those are a really nice way of displaying them. Like, just having, like, the, the pretty fabric on the wall and using that to put the pins into. I think I'd probably set up something like that. 
if I wanted a way to display all of my pins. But I don't know where I'd put it, is the thing. I'm not sure where I'd fit it. But uh, I also do have a bag as well with like a clear front panel, like the, the Ita bags. <laughs> where it's got like the clear panel in the front and then you can unzip it and put stuff inside, but it keeps it uh, protected. So that, that would be a good way to display pins, I think. Because then I could use it like as a bag and display them while going out as well without worrying about losing them, without worrying about them getting like detached and falling off. And then you can go there. You can go there. You can go there. We have the Murray page. <laughs> yeah. Oh, actually, I'm, I'm going to move this over a tiny bit. Move banana down a bit. Yeah, like that. I think that's a good sticker page. I like that. <laughs> and then me in the corner. Me in the corner with my pop cat. <laughs> Scouts on it. How about merch on it? Honor for everything. Wait, how am I getting the stickers off again? That's the joy of this notebook. This isn't a notebook. This is a sticker book. All of the pages in this book, it's not regular paper. This is sticker back paper. The paper in this book is like, it's like the backing of a sticker sheet. So basically you can put a sticker down, but then you can still just peel it back off again because it's the, the sticker backing. And that was one of the parts of my merch bundle. It's exclusively sticker book. And it's so nice. It's so fun because it means like, if I place something in the wrong way, like I've made this like so misaligned over here. If you put something in the wrong place, you can just peel it up and put it back down again. It's so, so good. But I love it so much and it's so cute. Look how cute it is. It's so cute. <laughs> oh, I love my merch. I'm so happy with it. My anniversary merch turned out so nicely. Right, where, did, where did I put the postcard? Oh, I put it in the stack. I put it in a stack of things. I'm not getting that back out. But he has part of it, at least. And the stickers to go with it. This, I love him. I love him so much. Wait, no, I need to... That way. Ta-da! Like the little Tamagotchi-style Liri with the my automaton. And then here we have my... Yeah, this is my Bell House page. Bell House and also me drawn by Feriko from Studio Nekamata. That's what that page is for. And then this page is the Heart of the Woods and Highway Blossoms page. And I'll, I'll find something for up there. And then this is the Plappy Bappy Happy page. And then this is the Marigato page. And then when I get more stickers, they will each get their own pages. And I got so many. I got so many. But I love it so much. It's like, I didn't even know that sticker books were a thing until I was looking into like merchandise options and I saw it as an option. I was like, wait, how does that work? I need one of these. I need one of these for myself. Therefore, I'm going to make it as merchandise for everybody else. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, I, I won't forget to return Xander's card as well. I will remember when I'm putting everything else away again. Slowly, slowly but surely. Oh, you can see my light reflecting. I put it like there. There we go. Ha ha! Merchandise! I got so many nice things. It's so good. But yeah, I think that's all the stuff I wanted to show off. Wait, let's, let's also get my Nekamata magnet here. And my dinosaur nugget keychain. Look at all this Lyri stuff. <laughs> I never thought I'd have this much merchandise. I love it so much. Hold on, let me find my keys as well for the other two key rings. Okay, 
Let me just hold some of this in my hand so you can't see it. Like my keys and my little like tab club cards for shops. You, you don't get to see those. But uh, this is this is my my key ring at the moment. It's uh this is Hiragiyu. This is part of Yukon's merch, which I really, really love. This is I Heart Cabbage, which I've had for years. And now has a new meaning with my friends the Cabbage Garden. <laughs> I don't know how we ended up calling ourselves the Cabbage Garden, but I'm really glad we did, because it, it means I can ha have a reason for this keychain. And then there's me. And then there's me. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. I got, there's three now. There's three. Now I just need to make a keychain of me in my Magical Girl outfit. <laughs> And then another two. <laughs> but I love, I love my keychains. Uh, with this one, uh, the the ring actually fell off the top of the keychain, so I just kind of like attached it with a little like phone charm clip thing. But it's okay. But I love them. Let's let's put that on here for now. My keys! There is definitely more keychain than actual key here. Like, I, I have one key. I have my front door key. I have some, like, club cards for shops. And then it's mostly keychains. <laughs> but it means I can always find it in my bag. Like, I never struggle looking for my keys because I just reach into my bag. I feel plastic. I pull it out and the rest of the keys come out with it. <laughs> But I, I love it so much. I've got so much nice stuff. Right, that's that's all I really had to show off for the stream. So anything from now on, I, I don't know what I'm doing. So it's just going to be whatever comes to mind now. <laughs> but yeah, this is all of my... All of the stuff I've gotten recently. Because there's so much. Because it's like, it's really nice having all of the merchandise from Marigato. Uh, getting the without a voice Kickstarter stuff, getting the please be happy anniversary stuff. That I meant to post like at the start of the year. It's been so long and I keep just forgetting to make a post about it. So like at least now, now that I've like shown it off on stream, I can at least like take screenshots and be like, look, I, I, I got this thing. Because <laughs> it's so nice too. It feels bad not to talk about it. And the, the limited run Heart of the Woods switch and the physical copies of the other games, and my own merch, and the Studio Nekamata merch. So many nice things. Like, I really love the t-shirts. I love how soft the t-shirts are. I showed off the t-shirts right at the start too, so I'm, I'm gonna show them off again for anyone who joined later on. Because as part of the, the Studio Nekamata collaboration, oh, where's the standing? I put it right here. Verpro and Studio Nekomata collaboration. There is this. There is a patch for Mia that is being sent to me, but I don't have it yet. There is my magnet. And then there is Momoka t-shirt. It is so pink. And look how cute this is. Look how cute that is. Look, it's so cute. What is that? That's a bit of cardboard. <laughs> but it's so cute. It's so soft. You would not believe how like wonderfully soft this is. It is so comfy. Uh, I got them a size big, a size too big for me so that I can wear them oversized. And I'm really glad I did because I, I, like, I like oversized clothes. But uh, I think I, I feasibly could have gotten a small and it still would have been fine. But uh, it, they're so, so comfy and nice and lovely. I love it. And then there's also the Geist t-shirt. Geist t-shirt with onion. And this one is glow in the dark, which is the coolest thing. I've not tested the glow in the dark out yet. Wait, I wonder how dark I could make it in my room. I wonder if I could actually... No, it's still quite bright out. I don't know if I could. Let me let me see what happens if I hold on. 
No, I think it's still too light in here. Nah, it's still too light in my room. But it's so cool. Like, the glow in the dark is, like, the, the coolest glow. I've seen pictures of other people's. And it says tamanegi, which means onion. <laughs> but yeah, they're such nice t-shirts. I'm, I'm really excited to just wear these all the time. <laughs> but yeah, so much nice stuff. Hee hee. But yeah, I love my magnets. Oh, hold on, actually. Hey, I just stuck it to my, my monitor stand. My monitor stands metal. I stuck my magnet to it. Yay! <laughs> you can't see it because it's behind my monitor, but I I found a place to stick one of my magnets. Woohoo! Right, what else should I do now? I don't know what else I have to show off. I feel like I showed everything I wanted to. What if I just get my dice out? <laughs> I'm just here like, when in doubt, show and tell. I get my dice. <laughs> Stop. This isn't even all of them too. I I can't fit all of my dice in here. So I have like another little tray with more dice in and also like leftover Lego parts. <laughs> yeah, how many dice does one need? Yes. What's the roll for today? Oh, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's find one that's got like a really easy to read number. I think this one. Right, what is my luck for today? A four. I got a four. Great. <laughs> oh, thank you for pouring dice on my head. Does that mean I get advantage? I'm gonna say it does. 18, I'll take it. Yes, much better. Wait, no, I should do the axolotl die. I should use this one. What is my roll? What is my luck? I can't see, what is it? 13. I got a 13. But yeah, uh, it's so funny though. Recently the clip's been going around again of the time when I was showing this die off for the first time and the camera wouldn't focus on the one. So I'm gonna do it now. So it's like this, this die is very special because if you if you look at the, the 20, the 20 is a little axolotl face and it is so cute. But then if you go to a one, oh, it's upside down, hold on. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> crit fail. It's a really good die, I love it. But yeah, I've got some really nice sets, but I'm always really pained because I want a pink and teal set. But the closest I've gotten is this set right here. And this one is like, the teal is really nice, but it's more purpley than pink. It's not really like a pink set. So like, if I could get something like this with this teal color, but with like actual pink instead of purple, this would be perfect. It would be my ideal set of dyes. But alas, it is not. But yeah, I have uh, four different sets in here. And I still want more as well. <laughs> I want more dyes. I really like these ones. I love the color of these ones. They don't show very well on the webcam. The webcam makes everything way more blue than it actually is. Which is a little bit annoying. But like in real life, these are the most perfect shade of teal. And I love them so much. I just wish that the numbers weren't gold. I wish they were silver instead. Or pink. Or even if the if the numbers were pink, that could work. Ah, oh, much to think about. But uh, Zarok, hello! Thank you for the hydrate and posture check. Let me have a big stretch. I stretch my arms out. Ooh. Big stretch, sit up straight. But uh, welcome, welcome, so many Lyries. I know, my my tri triplets, we're triplets. <laughs> Three of us, more. <laughs> but welcome, welcome. 
Welcome on in. Thank you for the hydrate and posture check. I'm gonna have some monster. Aha. Monster energy. I do have water as well. I do, I do have a bottle of water that I'm drinking. But the monster is the priority. <laughs> it's having a sip every now and then. But uh, welcome in, welcome to hand cam time. I just finished showing off all of the merchandise I have that I've had for like, I've been meaning to share this merchandise for a long time. I keep meaning to like take photos of it. And then I just don't get around to it. Cause I'm always like, I want to take a nice photo. I want to show this off nicely. I want to make a proper post about it. And then I never get around to it because I'm so busy and I can't take a nice photo. So my goal for the future is like, whenever I get something, I don't care how bad the photo is. I'm just going to snap a photo and post about it because otherwise it's probably not going to get done for months. And I, I want to stop doing that because then I get stressed out thinking about the fact that I haven't taken a photo of it too. And that stress stays there until I finally do it. And then if I don't do it, that stress just stays forever. So it's not ideal. But yeah, in the future, I want to share things quicker. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 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 Yeah, I've got the full sets. And then my other dice are here. And these are like, these are the dice I don't use as much. Like these ones are nice, but they're, it's, it's a really nice color but they're incredibly cheap and they feel cheap to roll. And then these ones, these ones are just spiky. These ones are so pretty. I love these dice, they're so pretty, but none of the edges have been sanded. They are spiky, they are painful, and I don't like using them. So that's why these, these two sets are the ones that I've left out of the, the big old mimic. I've also got some pins on the front. <laughs> Yeah, how spiky are the mimic teeth? They're not they're not spiky. They're they're very blunt. This is a retired mimic. <laughs> they're like rounded edges, so they're not like super spiky. But it's such a cool chest. I love this chest so much. It's so nice, because you just see it, you're just like, oh yeah, that's a regular treasure chest. Nothing to worry about in there. And then it eats all my dice. <laughs> Oh, I dropped one. No. Okay, I got it. Okay. Moment of fear. I'm like, whenever I drop a die, I'm like, I, I can't leave it. If I leave this die and don't pick it up immediately, it's going to be lost forever. But there we go. Here we go. My, my poor little rescue mimic that can't eat on its own. So I, I feed it. It's so nice. My dice chest. Oh wait, I know what else I can show off as well. Hold on. Uh, the other day, the other day, this was months ago now, this was a while ago. Uh, Xander randomly came into my room the one day and he just came up to me and he said, put out your hand. And so I put out my hand even though I wasn't expecting it to be anything decent. Like I thought he was going to put an empty wrapper in my hand or something or like a like a crisp packet so I put my hand out and he put something in my hand and I turned to look at it and I gasped because it was not what I was expecting it was not rubbish it was not a wrapper it was this it was a rat prison look at this the eternal rat prison <laughs> you made a rat prison truly the greatest gift and it's been on my desk ever since i've i've as, ever since he gave this to me it has lived on my desk i love my rat prism <laughs> it's so cute but yeah i don't know why he did it but i'm glad he did yeah oh you know what i mean about the sharp dice you have amethyst ones and they're dangerous yeah it's it's the main reason why i wouldn't go for like crystal dice i'd be so scared of like damaging them and also like pointy edges and stuff. Like it always amazes me how sharp they are. 
like regular dice are bad enough when you think of like a d4 and how pointy they are but when it's got like the the razor sharp edges i'm just like i don't want to roll these i don't like rolling them oh you're expecting him to put a frog on my head <laughs> if he did that i would be genuinely impressed i'd be like where the heck did you get a frog from there are no ponds around us I'd be impressed. I wouldn't be scared or anything. I'd just be like, where did you get this frog from? And also, how did you get it in here without Tiffany noticing? <laughs> but uh, I love my dice. Uh, there are D4s that are literally caltrops. <laughs> it's terrifying. Dangerous. Worse than Lego bricks. Wait, no, I know one more thing I can show as well. Let me grab my... My dice tray. I have a dice tray to roll them into. There. Hold on, my, my headphones got caught. But uh, I got a, a gift from my friends for Christmas. I got a cat tray to roll my dice in. Look at this. Look how cute this is. Look at this. It's like, it's just got poppers, so you can flatten it down for storage. Just like that. But then you just like, attach all the poppers in the corners. And it's a little, a little, a little cat tray for rolling dice. It's great. <laughs> I love it so much. Oh, you have one of those in black. Oh, nice. I approve. But yeah, it's so nice, because then I can just go, whoop. <laughs> that was a natural one. It flipped over to a 19 when I moved it, but that, that, was a, that was a one. I rolled a one. That's, um... You know what? We don't need to worry about the dice. Not a problem. Let us leave that. Two dice jail. Oh, wait. Yeah, you're right. Which one was it? I forgot which one it was. Was it this one? No, it wasn't that one. Oh, it was this one. Was it? I don't remember which one it was. I'll go back in the vault afterwards. Yeah, you two... You two wait there until I can fully sentence the correct criminal to their crime. <laughs> but yeah, I'm, I'm glad I did this stream. I was worried about doing a hand cam stream without any Lego to do, because I feel like I've... <laughs> I've kind of gone to a point where every time I do a hand cam stream, I'm, I'm building Lego. I'm doing like a Lego set. So the thought of doing a hand cam stream without the Lego, I was like, can I do it? Do I have enough stuff? But I, I clearly do, because it's taken me three hours to get through everything. <laughs> so I'm glad I did. I'm glad I got to show everything off. I got to show off all the, the really cool stuff I've got. All the money I've spent recently. Me being here, like, earning money through my merch and then immediately spending it on other merch for other things. Responsible spending. I'm 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 an adult and I I always do the right thing. <laughs> oh, it's like I, I really should be putting some in savings, but I'm just here like, but look at all of these physical material goods that I need in my life. I can't resist it. I, I just love them. It's too many nice things, that's the problem. But uh, I think thankfully I think I'm happy with the nice things I have at the moment. I, I can restrain from spending at least for a little bit now because I've got so many things and also because I've pre-ordered the Outer Wilds a special edition like archaeologist edition bundle and that's something that I've paid for as a pre-order but it hasn't arrived yet so that is more physical goods that I'm looking forward to and I don't have to worry about money with that because I already bought <laughs> So I don't have to worry about spending money for that, but I still have exciting things to look forward to in the mail. I also am waiting on a gym button from the Stanley Parable. There was a, a physical 
special edition of the Stanley Parable. Uh, ultra, ultra deluxe, ultra deluxe, gym. And I wanted to get that, but I couldn't justify spending that much money on it at the time. However, they did also have a pre-order up for a gym button. And I feel like it would have been wrong if I didn't buy that. Like, I was looking at it and I was like, I have to, I, I, I need to buy it. Like, it would be wrong if I did not purchase this button. I need this button. So I ordered that too. So I'm waiting on a gym button, <laughs> which I am so excited to get. I'm, I'm really looking forward to that. Like of all the merchandise from Stanley Parable, I'm so glad they made a gym button. I can't wait to just be here going right, gym, 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 gym. <sighs> but yeah, this was a nice stream though. A comfy time. I think what I might end up doing is, uh, I was wondering about like just stretching out the time to reach the, the four hours I usually get to when I'm streaming. But I feel like I've done enough. I feel like I've shown off everything I wanted to. And if I just like sit here for half an hour, I don't, I don't know how fun that would be. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna like have this as the point that I end the stream at. And then that gives me time to try and clear up my absolute disaster site of a bedroom right now. Because I, I literally turned my room upside down trying to find these postcards earlier. I was so frantically just pulling boxes out, sorting things, like everything is all over the floor. And then it was in my sticker book the whole time. I still can't believe that. I'm still just... I still cannot believe that. But it's okay. At least I have them. At least I haven't lost them. That's the good part. But yeah, I think that's going to be it for the hand cam for now. So bye-bye. Goodbye to the hands for now. Until the next time. Until the next time I get them out. Hands. Heart. What's the... Th is that like the, the Gen Z heart? That feels so weird to do. I don't know how to do that. I'm a millennial. Chunky heart. But uh, with that, I'm going to... Bloop. I'm gonna head on over to here and we can find a raid target. That was really nice though. I'm so glad I got the chance to show everything off. I can finally stop feeling guilty about all the photos I haven't taken. Because now I can just clip the stream and just be like, I didn't take a photo, but I've got so much footage of the, the stuff in 3D space. Check that out. Right, let me, let me, uh, recover my keyboard. Where is my keyboard? How am I going to sneak this back? Okay. I think I got it. Okay, I have a keyboard again. I'm powerful. I have the power again. Yeah, the index middle heart is bizarre. I don't know. Like, it just feels like it wouldn't be easy to do. Like, the the whole hand heart is so, so easy to just make the shape. The, the other one feels like it requires more maneuvering. It's not just like a fast, there's the heart. I prefer my way. But uh, thank you so much, everyone, for joining me today, for, for having a look at all the lovely merch I have. And before I go, I can do up. Uh, I my N keeps sticking on my keyboard. The letter N keeps sticking, and it's so annoying. But uh, I'm hopefully going to be getting a new keyboard soon, though, which I'm very much looking forward to. I am in talks with a friend to try and figure out a, a really nice keyboard situation for me. But until then, I've got to keep making do with this one. <laughs> but Ella, Ella. But yeah, thank you so much, everyone, for joining me. Yeah, I, I do like the finger hearts, though. Like, the, the thumb and the finger one, the little hearts. I think that one's cute. But uh, yeah, thank you for joining me today. Thank you for having a look at all my stuff with me. I love stuff. I'm a big fan of stuff. Now I've got to go tidy up and try and find places to put this stuff. But uh, let's try find a raid target. Let's see who's on. is around. Who do we want to read? Hmm. Ba -ba -ba. 
Oh, there's a few people online. There's a few people I know who are on. Wait, you know what? I might do a really risky raid. I don't know. Oh no, no, I think I'm safe. I think we're safe, I think we're good. Okay, I, w I was ready to be noping out of the stream immediately. But uh, what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna, I know I literally raided her yesterday. I know she was the raid yesterday, but I wanna raid Mari again because of me going through her merch <laughs> in the hand cap. <laughs> because I showed off her merch, I wanna send the raid over to Mari. She's playing Final Fantasy XIV at the moment. And I was getting prepared to like run away because everything is Dawn Trail at the moment. And I haven't finished Endwalker yet. I'm still like, level 85 quests in Endwalker. I'm not even close to Dawn Trail. But it's okay because it looks like she's very early game. She's like... Base game Heavensward-ish? Like, she's not very far, I don't think. Either way, she's she's not at Dawn Trail time, so... So I'm gonna send you over Mari's way, and then I'm gonna try and... Try tidying my room. Uh, please wish me luck with that, because, oh my goodness, there's a lot of stuff in here. <laughs> No, it's not Two Fold Tuesday. Wait, it's, it's doing the wrong message. Hold on, that's not the raid message. That's the raid message. That's the raid message. There we go. It's not Tuesday. Although, I mean, it was kind of Two Fold Wednesday, too, with me showing off all the standees. But yes, thank you so much, everyone, for joining me today. It has been a lot of fun. I'm glad I got to show all my stuff off. Especially my merch. Like, it... It feels bad that I have my merch and I still haven't, like, posted photos and stuff. But I want them to look good. I want the photos to look good. I will take them soon. This week. I will make sure they are posted this week. But yes, thank you. Thank you for the good luck on the cleaning. It's like, it's not so much cleaning. Like, everything is clean. Nothing is dirty. It's just tidying. Tidying and organizing. That's my problem. <laughs> so that is the challenge for tonight. But uh, it has been so much fun, though. I'm, I'm so glad I got to do this. But yes, that is it from me for now. I'm going to head off and cry. <laughs> no, I won't cry. I'll be powerful. I'll clear it all up. <laughs> Thank you so much, everyone, for joining me today. And until next time, bye-bye.